All right. Hi, I'm Neil. I'm joined with Head Bob and Truly. Truly is stepping away for a minute because, uh, you know, it's so quick between games. Yeah. Uh, so this game starts off with a quick cutscene. So let's get into it. Three, two, one, go. Oh, I forgot one cut text box. So yeah, this is the uh, the other 3DS game. We oh, truly did Omega Ruby yesterday without it to come because I had tech issues. We're now still getting to show both of them. Yeah, so we got a uh, Alpha Sapphire. It's uh, the counterpart of Omega Ruby, different enough to have a split category. Yeah. It's um, quite brutal. Quite brutal. That, yeah, is that makes it worth the <laughs> split? Huh? Differences that makes it require a split. Groudon, and those are quite different. Latios and Latias is the main difference between two games, really. With a Latios just being, or um, so much better because of its special attack is the main side you need. And basically, Latias has high special defense and low special attack, while Latios is a special attack and low special defense. The main yep. move you use is special attack. Like the best Latias is about it's just slightly better than the worst Latios. Yep. And it's just first we check pick the girl because uh just said our rival's nature. For uh, what like two fights, right? The rain yep. uh yeah, rival two and rival four. Rival two is where it's, where it's really important. Yeah. And um yeah, it's a lot of cuts in the beginning. Where we're going to look for is uh, some special stats on Mudkip. We want to want at least 14 attack, 10 defense, 10 special attack, and hopefully 10 speed. But 9 is is kind of doable, but it just makes a lot of the fights way brutal to have the negative spe uh, speed. But right, right. So I do have a backup prepared in case. But, the conditions for Mudkip are indeed pretty, pretty strict. More strict than some of the other starters you reset for in the later gen games. Um, it's technically, forty-two percent chance to get a runnable kit, but that's uh, if you like, take the bare minimum. Yeah, but worse than a coin flip, not not ideal. Oh, I always take the bare minimum because uh, IRL time save. True, 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 true. Uh, also, I love how, and when you uh, got into the car, like you're playing a, a GPA, you start off like a GPA, like the original games. I think that's great. Yeah, I love that. I it always what? like every time I played a Mega Ruby Alpha Sapphire like casually, I always was like for a second, wait, am I playing the wrong game? <laughs> this always starts like that. It's such a, a cool remake. Yeah, so the other major difference in Alpha Sapphire and Mega Ruby is uh, the teams and which Pokemon they have. Um, and addition, in addition to Latias versus Latios, um, Sharpedo is a lot worse for the Latias to fight than um, than Camerups are. So it's like twice, it's like kind of, you know, when it rains, it's just all set up to fail. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so we have to get an extra TM for Latias so that we can just make it through. Um, we're gonna see all of that later on. Well, it's, yeah, it's basically split, split up into three sections. Okay, your Mudkip section, your uh, Lot section, and then your Box Legendary section. Oh. Uh huh. Uh. Also, just. The only thing that gets me through these resets is the music. Yeah, <laughs> true. Absolutely. Yeah, What's up, Truly? What's up? How to get a beverage? Yeah. Drink. Oh. Gotta stay Water. hydrated. Right. So yeah, we're just, you know, being introduced to our nice little friend here. Our neighbor, you only have two houses in town. Uh, that's three, right? 
Well, yeah, there's two houses in the lab. But yeah. Do you think the assistants just sleep on the floor in the lab? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, don't, I guess I guess he must live there. Yeah, somewhere. And pick the mud kip. Hopefully it is good. Yep. Oh, no shiny. Oh well. Dead. Ah, uh, no. No two shot. I got two shot in practice. Okay. Luck didn't carry over. Always in practice. Yeah, I guess we're, we're gonna figure out if this Mudkip's runnable um, after at the, one fight. the next level up, after Rival 1 fight. Um, Unlike really yesterday, where I did not have a backup, Fortunate does have a backup. Yes. So. We'll be chilling if it's not good enough to run. And make sure, and we don't. And it takes real so fast that it's faster to uh, not nickname your Pokemon. Yep. Didn't kind oh, of that's not a mashing, I forget. <laughs> that's a good world record. True. And the forest encounter? Right. Yep, same kind of encounter as the, the Pidgey and XY and some other ones in Gen 7. Cannot escape this one even with a repel. You just always encounter it. And it's uh, only level 3 encounter on the route, or level 3 worm pull. Yep. <laughs> and we get some potions here, and those are very useful. Yeah, you get a lot of them, too. Yeah, very convenient. Yeah, very nice. Not only do you have to buy them, you just get 10 of them as well, so... Is it more than 10? I don't know. Uh, it's 10. I think you get another one from somewhere else, like an 11th one. Someone else gives it to you. Alright, no encounter so far. That's good. Very nice. Very nice, very nice, very nice. Hopefully we have, you know, Naughty Bud Kip with perfect IVs. Hi. Easy. Oh, well, it's already impossible. <laughs> Darn. Oh, it could be plus attack though. Fine. Let's see. Oh. I reckon we are lonely. Let's see what we get. Oh, what a what a useful crit at the end there. <laughs> Ooh, wow. Uh, wow. <laughs> Holy I mean, moly. You could run 13 attack, I mean, if you wanted uh, to, but I mean, it was minus defense, I believe. Yeah. Uh, if you don't uh, like it, you could just you could do whatever you want. Uh, 11 speed? That's pretty good. Uh, let's go with it, sure. Yeah. Content. On. Yeah, minus defense. I mean, you have really good special attack, really good speed. 13, 10, 12, 11, 11 at 6. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's the biggest part is keeping track of stats for me. Although, I've gotten much better at it after all this practice. Yeah, it definitely takes some getting used to, for sure. Just like kind of rushing in between like mashing sections to click on certain stats. Yeah. Definitely What's nice in the that. early games are the I do use the uh, catching cutscene or after the Calvin. But yeah. Oh, it's really don't the only thing you really need to worry about is your defense. Early, early on. 
yeah. and I guess it'll you, it's nice to know you're attacking a uh, special attack too, but it's not as important. This is like uh, for the awkward run if we need to use water gun or yeah. tackle. A wild beezing water gun. I had three to four yesterday, so hopefully you have better than that. Speed? Three to four uh, attack. Oh, wow. <laughs> Yeah, not a zero to nine. Yeah, you have zero to nine. It's gonna be eight. Eight would be fine. I'd be down with eight. Sure, me too. Can you just cut the little grass here to avoid it? You get less likely chance for counters. That's why I play with deep pad in the beginning, it's just for that little section right there. And I avoided that all by cutting through the crafts there. <laughs> Never punish though. Yeah. Hey, Again, this is Gen okay. 6, wherever you have the diagonal movement that you can use. It's actually really useful in a bunch of sections in this game. Yeah, that's the difference between the game I just ran, XY, and ORAS. Um, diagonals are a lot more lenient in this game. You can just kind of go up to them and press A, and it like moves your character towards them. It's like really handy. Exactly. Just roll. It's a really good roll, actually. Yeah. yeah. Back in attack. Oh wow! Let's go. That's really good. <laughs> nice. Okay. Nice. Plus two on attack. I'll take That's it. That's great. It's great news. And defense yeah. as well. And defense too. Think yeah. Have, yeah. Then you have a. Uh, this is a great. You have twenty-eight to thirty-one minus defense. Yep. Yep. No counters. Oh man. Wow. Oh. I have him hype. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> this this cutscene is always the weirdest for me. Like, yeah. we have this in the catching tutorial. Yeah. The feed is fine on my end, by the way, at uh, at the stream. It's good? So it's... There's something off with the, uh, the PSR stream. Yeah. Let's see. Oh. It just keeps freezing. But I don't think I don't think it's on your end because I, I yeah see you're it good unfortunately keep you're good okay all right um wait what the dosh oh it's back okay dream huh? oh, I refresh it. Fine. Alright. The PSR stream. Alright. Yeah, it's... My biggest for is my internet is, uh, not the greatest. Yeah. Understandable for sure. Uh, so yeah, Wally's... Wally's gonna learn how to catch a Pokemon. He's very shy. He's... Yep. You know? He's gonna find a very rare encounter and a first encounter every single time. Kind of a cheater. <laughs> Too bad it's shiny locked. Yeah. Yeah, this I think is a nice like, bathroom break. I Are think Rolt only has a uh, growl at this point, like in his move set, so just <laughs> just can't use anything. <laughs> yeah, Rolt gets a fusion like level six or something like that. Yeah, yeah. Rolt is just not very good. <laughs> Simply put. <laughs> It's pretty good though. More more dialogue. That's yeah. a nice chill early game. Yeah, for sure. The main thing about this game is 
whenever you're going for like top end and stuff, it comes down to really how many encounters you get in the early game. Yep. It's really unfortunate because like that's that's really like the turn that's what yeah. determines your pace in this game. Besides like a, a pooch fight and Roxanne can go weird sometimes, but other than that, it's mainly just encounters that determines your pace. Yeah, I had like five encounters on my PV. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Did it save for this fight? Oh. Yeah, definitely worth saving. Even though you can play around potions, there is sometimes, I guess, where uh, um, it can howl a bunch, and that way it yeah. just. Yeah, it just. Even a potion, it's gonna keep tackling you for over half. And the sand attacks to the stuff. Yeah, exactly. Well, at least I'm faster than it, so don't have to worry about that. Exactly. Yeah, it's really nice that, like, Tackle, like, obviously, Tackle's gotten buffed since uh, the original games here. And so it's not only more accurate, but it's also way more powerful. And so as a result, <laughs> this fight is just a lot more lenient. And also, in the original games, you wouldn't even have Water Gun anyways, so. Yeah. Ah, uh, unfortunate. Just hit. Yeah. yeah. Let's go. Yeah, and our speed's good enough there where we're out speeding that every time, so. Ooh. Plus zero on speed there. It's fine. It's, pl it's plus yeah. speed at least, uh -huh. And a little free heal. Plus speed six to seven. Oh, definitely 30, good enough. Thirty-one defense, <laughs> uh, negative defense. All right. Yeah, good enough. All right. No. I would have gotten no rest, Schultz. Definitely worth waiting there. That that guy can definitely be pretty annoying sometimes because. You have to run through, not only do you have to pass him, but you have to run through a lot of grass to pass him. So, like, I don't know, sometimes you have to stop in the grass and then yep. Yep. have to start running again in the grass. And I just feel like sometimes it messes with encounters. I don't know. Maybe I'm just crazy, but. Well, also, sometimes you can just get an encounter on the tile that he spins on. You can just get spun on while you get yeah. out of the encounter. There's, like, nothing you can do. It's like, you just accept your defeat. Yeah. And here we pick <laughs> up the most busted move for the other game. Yeah, Unreal. Unreal that's available this early. Such a broken move. There's another uh, spinner here. Right. Right. Easy. I like to come up through the middle here because it avoids uh, having to have Brandon move. Yeah, it, sh it should be faster, yeah. Yeah. You're coming into the cutscene at a different angle. It just feels faster. We fight one optional in the gym to hit the uh, level up. Yeah. Nice. Yep. Uh, Roxanne is actually quite a bad fight. If you don't hit, fight that optional, you lose quite a lot of experience and nose pass. Like, yeah, it does a lot more. Yeah, level you, nine or level more. ten, I can imagine. Yeah. And you hit the uh, last optional in the gym to because that one doesn't have security. Yep. Exactly right. Yeah, and all the optionals we fight, we fight two optional battles on this fight, or on this route, um, and they're both really important for their own reason. Alright. We'll talk about it a little bit. 
no, I'm gonna save for Roxanne just because yeah, you can yeah, get definitely. critted and then just yeah. Yep. Yeah, exactly. Saving is very fast, so it makes sense. Yeah. Unlike uh Gen 4. Yeah, definitely. Looking good. Yeah. Well, so I like, put all my IVs early on. So to... Unlike, uh, truly yesterday. And fight <laughs> until the very end. Sure. Ooh. Good. Yeah, already hits very hard. Yeah. Without the experience. Yeah. Or with the experience. Yeah, Roxanne only has one potion, so you want to draw that out. It's better to prefer to use it on the Geo dude than it is to use it on the Nose Pass. Yep, exactly. Uh, do I want to play around the crit? Uh, yeah. So that's 29 IV defense, I think. Yep, that's what I see. Yep. Oh, one for Harden. Alright, yeah. now I'm going to use Tackle for the rest okay. of the. Hey, yeah, we're, we're safe. L love safety. Mm -hmm. Alright. Eight. Oof. Oh, you're gonna get hit in the torrent. Oh, that's here. not gonna die. Yeah, yeah. unfortunately. I get hit in the torrent, gonna be doing more damage. Crit would have killed it, but. Yeah, unfortunately, okay. you have to heal. Where we don't. Then I'm gonna have to save for Hiker Clark anyway. Yeah, yeah. you're good. Yeah. yeah. We live a rollout from here, so that's really nice. Even still. Well, I got crit at even, the end there. Even All right. still, you're good. <laughs> Wait, I think. You level, up to, you level up to 11 as well. Alright, 5 attack. Oh, you're right, you level up again, yeah. yeah. 5 attack? It's better than I had. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> yeah, and it, having bad attack isn't, you know, the end of the world. You're, I mean, you definitely can get through it. It's just, you know, at the top end, you're just, you just uh, lose turns here and there. I'm gonna go get another cutscene. I, I have those little waddle that Grunt does. It's just, it just uh, makes me laugh every time. I kind of never noticed that. I never noticed that either. <laughs> I think because uh, I'm funny. always just like putting in my stats or something. It's just funny. And again, come through them and go right into the cutscene so the NPC walks less. Yep. And you pick up the repel here. Oh, come on. Get a little trilled there. Yeah. Could be a little tricky trying to pick up stuff from uh, diagonally. Very nice. And wow. Yep. That was going really good. <laughs> and all the, yeah, all that grass is uh, non repelled grass, so you can get encounters there up to that point. So, yeah. Very nice to not get any, any encounters there. I've seen people get zero, and then also seen people get like three, so. It'd be really silly. I'm gonna do mud slap here because it has sturdy. And the world. Oh! Alright. <laughs> it does help that it lowers accuracy too. Just yeah, overall, but then, right? it's only damaging move, it's one in four to use it. Uh, yeah. Oh. Alright, and big menu. First menu. Oh, Themo. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna do a menu here. Gonna repel, gonna heal up to full HP. I'm also gonna teach a couple moves. Uh, both very important moves. Uh, Rock Tomb in this game is actually quite more valuable than it is in Omega Ruby. Yes, uh, you definitely absolutely. need it. You definitely need it. Like in Omega Ruby, it's kind of just like whatever you can get by without teaching it. But in this game, you actually really, really need it. Yep. And it's not possible to skip it at all.
Why can't you skip it? Uh, you can't skip it in this game, uh, because mainly the Carvanas in yeah. the museum, you really need it. Those. Do you really have another... I mean, you, you're, yeah. you're slower than them? Yeah, you're... you're slower than them, and you don't really have a more like, powerful move like that. Yeah, it's just, it's just the move to use. You just, yeah. Exactly. You drop their speed, it makes you faster than them, and then you can two-shot them both. Yep. Would be nice to have like a march tom or whatever, but it's like not really realistic. Yeah. Alright. 20 yeah, special and, pack. Yeah. And fighting uh, those optionals is really important to ensure we hit level 13 for uh, this, for Brawly's gym coming up. Really important to be level 13 for Hideki. Yes. 13 for Hideki is kind of, like, required. <laughs> yeah. You really couldn't win the fight with 12. For a variety of reasons. Oh, is he, can you really win the fight to begin with? Yeah. Guess you're right. Theoretically, it's possible to win. <laughs> Alright, and we're gonna get, uh, first time. First, first try. Yeah. Hopefully. And then also, if we do shopping after this menu, which mm -hmm. you can uh, skip in Omega Ruby. Yeah. Yep. Because super potions are very valuable for the museum with the Carvanas, because they hurt a lot. Yeah, there is a a world where you can get by without, you know, healing in the museum, but like, it's also so a world risky. Where, there's, yeah, there's also a world where if you don't have super potions at all, you literally could just die. So, yep. it's just really, really important to have these. And also, there's scenarios on Hideki where having super potions can uh, save you as well. Yep, also true. Like, if you get low sweep turn one and two, you get a super potion, and then hopefully just get like foresight into focus energy or something, and then live. Well, I think it helps more for when you miss the range, because like if you yeah, get, yeah, yeah. get double low sweep, you just you're just dead. You can't kill it fast enough. Yeah. Super to four, and then pray. No, but then your echoed voice, like you're still at half yeah. HP. It's like yeah, you could win, I guess, but. I can do some chopping. Yeah. It's already here, we're just gonna Oh die. my god. Oh, okay. That's sloppy. Hey, yeah, it's already in here, we're just gonna buy the repels, and we're, uh, instead of uh, picking the one up in Duford, we're just gonna grab this one. We're just gonna go ahead and buy two. It's worth it. Yeah. Super Potion in Duford's quite out of the way. Yeah. So if you don't, if you have to shop anyways, it's well worth it. Well worth it. I just love to spin up the hole down there. <laughs> yeah, really nice. <laughs> All right, no encounters. <laughs> All right. Off to Duford. And we pick up the uh, silk scarf. Just helps out a lot. Indeed. Yeah, we're gonna be using Echo Voice. I mean, no scarf is just a must. Must have. So it just happens that it's very convenient that it just happens to be right here. Like right before we need it. Nice. 
Nice oh. coffee bath. Can't say I'm a fan. <laughs> This fighting be a little trolly. Use it to uh, endure and protect. Yeah, endure, protect. Also, confusion. Be pretty silly. Yeah, so detect is. I mean, detect is kind of silly, but I mean, it actually stacks up your Echo Boy still, even with the yeah. uh, detect, so it actually helps a little bit. Didn't get confused, all right. Yeah, exactly. And now, the worst fight the worst in the run. Fight? For sure. <laughs> yeah, definitely saving care. Yeah. Like, if there's one fight you can choose to save for in the whole entire run, this is definitely that fight. I think it's a me. Three tries on my PV. <laughs> it's just such a bad fight. It's like the win rate is just so low. It really depends on your your um your mudkip as well. Ninety three percent chance, including crits. Oh, that's uh. Yeah, with this kind of defense, something like this can happen. Uh. You okay. still survive. Come on. Nope. Uh, and that's why we save. Yeah, indeed. Uh, that's unfortunate. Uh, Wait, okay. Yeah, it's just... It takes so long to just, uh, reset. That's, that's yeah. a real time loss. <laughs> it's really unfortunate. It's just nothing you can do. I mean, if he just chooses to attack you twice, it's just... Yeah. The range guaranteed? I'm, I wasn't. No, it's 93.6%. Okay, so Foresight Turn 1 is very, very good. Uh, when you get Foresight Turn 1. Okay. Oh, man. Wow, but Why are you doing a, this was much? That one, was that a 1 in. Oh, my God. I don't know how I was doing this much. I feel like I shouldn't be doing this much. No, that's how much it does. 18 okay. to 19, 21? Yeah, yeah. Six. Um, if only it was 30. Oh man. I know. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, it's nah. very, very yeah, this is definitely heading to the decky moment. The worst fight in the game for a reason, it's just Yeah, it's just our HP. If we had one more HP too, it'd be good too. So HP defense is a big problem. Yeah. I might just get one oh by Hideki, God. to be honest. And that, uh... Could still get okay. me, you Bigger know? Foresight. Foresight. Oh my God. My mm. goodness. Yeah, this is a moment. You, well, you got it first try, right? Yeah. Yeah, this is the other, this is the other end of it. <laughs> uh, just like, uh... We're going to get the God Lottie ass to make up for it. Right. Alright, this time surely I'm feeling it this time. Hideki is the true gym leader, seriously. You're three defense EVs away from getting a free Oh fight. my god. That's just so sad. It's uh, yeah, that's so unfortunate. It's just, it's just the the defense the defense combination with this HP combo is just oh, very brutal. unfortunate. Yeah, our HP is like basically minimum, or it just is minimum. Yeah. Ugh. All right, believe. Me too, actually. Hmm. Dude, just foresight into focus energy, and we're good. Right here. I'm a believer.
Here the fuck? Oh. Is oh my god. Okay, it can still- Foresight, foresight, foresight! Yes! yes. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. And we hit the range, too. <laughs> yeah, even if you, uh, get, you know, the three Echoed Voice, it's still a range. Yeah. I'm, I'm, uh, saving after that. I'm not- Oh. Yeah, so it's literally the worst. You get the perfect Hideki, you think everything's gonna go well, and then you just miss the range. Like, yeah. It's... That's the worst. We'll never see that man I mean, again. Matt came in the wrong time because that was like six try. <laughs> <laughs> wow! <laughs> so I think it was like I think it was like fourth try. Yeah, it was like fourth try. Yeah. yeah. All I know is I lost uh, two and a half minutes or no three minutes from that. Not exactly the, the best. <laughs> right. Well, that's just you know the worst part of the uh, mud kip section, really. Yeah. Uh -huh. I mean, yeah. I mean, that definitely put on a good. A, a good showing of why that is the worst fight in the run. Oh my god. Oh. It's fine. This Machop should die now, I would say. Yeah, he's gonna die once. Yeah. Good special attack. We've used so many Echo Voices. Not that it actually matters, but. No. But. Yeah, you, uh. Ether right after this fight. Right, Naomi. Yeah, gonna do a little minion here. Gonna ether up our echoed voice so we need uh, our PP back. Uh, going to take off the Sylph Scarf. And yeah. That'll be it. Normally you would heal there if you were damaged, but. You can get trolled right. here a little. Oh, you're gonna save for Brawly. Yeah. Pretty hard to die to Brawly, but I definitely have died to Brawly. I'm sure uh, Fortunate has, and yeah. has probably died to Brawly at some point. Oh, yeah. Well. yeah, 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 plenty of times. Yeah, dying to Brawly is always very unexpected because it's not. shouldn't happen. Right. Oh, good map. We'll teach you the ways. <laughs> like I'm gonna teach you candy floss. True. Oh no. Alright, so we got seismic toss there. Let's see what it does on the second turn. Karate chop. This is still fine. Uh... This is fine. Mak so even though the Makuhita has a damaging move, it really doesn't like going for it, and I'm not sure why, but. It will, it will only go for arm thrust if it sees that one one hit puts it in. Or one hit, one hit, will kill it, basically. Yeah. So you have to be like, like five All HP right. or something. And so now we just need to hit. I'm gonna always heal there. All right. Oh. Right, consistency gaming. It's all about that IRL time save. Yep. Right. Z Jordan, can you blame me that much? <laughs> yeah, but done with Brawly though, it's very nice. We're we are gonna have to heal to full HP though for these museum fights. This is like one of the main differences right away in the early game that uh, is different between Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. Or Omega Ruby, you're seeing Nummels in this game, you're seeing Carvanas, so uh, yep. definitely, <laughs> definitely makes this museum a lot worse. Carvanas are just a lot more scarier. They're just they got better moves. They're faster. Like like focused energy into bite. Like and you, you can just. Things can get really weird really fast. Uh, another cutscene. Yep. Steven.
Uh, all these cousins actually kind of why I like um, Oras. It's a lot of uh, mental breaks. Yeah. Yeah, Oras is a very, very beginner friendly game, I would say. Uh, it's really fun and chill. Um, like learning it. Very fun run. 10 out of 10 recommend to literally anybody. I for uh, I recommend Alpha Sapphire. I don't recommend Ru Omega Ruby though. <laughs> no. Why would you like consistency? <laughs> True. Doorways are just so terrible. <laughs> sure. Especially when you get on a bike. Oh. Doorways are one thing, but ladders are a whole other animal. Oh, I don't even start. <laughs> your road. Oh my god. Ratio. <laughs> Little break from mashing. All right. Yep. I'm gonna get the soft sand right here from this girl on the beach. Very important to get this. The PP up. Yep. We sell that yep. later for a lot of money. Indeed. Advancing on. I'm going to save before uh, the fights here because. Yeah, um, definitely want to save for these fights. Kind of like a must save spot, I feel like, an Alpha Sapphire. Yeah. Or a marathon setting. Oh, at least I'm fast. That's. Yeah. I'm used to playing with terrible speed, so. Sure. Choice. Yeah, so these fights, you're just going to um, rock two times two. Carbana is faster than range. Huh. Yeah, that attack. Oh. Uh, a lot of damage. Good roll. Alright. Very, right. nice. Very nice. Yeah, honestly, I forgot about these being ranges with your attack. Oh, God. Zubat is. 116 range. <laughs> Alright, no problem. We're gonna hit it though. Yeah. Just not gonna get uh, confused. Oh, it's... Just crit, forehead. Cool. Right, wow. Oh, well. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> exactly, just uh. crit. Uh, That's definitely a heal here, though. Oh, this might yeah. be Aqua Jet range, so I think this is just... Oh, no, it is. is. It is, yeah. Alright, 6 speed. Alright. I guess it's not... Oh, oh my god. Yeah. Fortunate. Okay. Oh, oh no. my god. Just. Right. This. Okay. That's uh, really actually a loss. Even... I can't believe it. Oh, okay. yes, let's go. Oh. Right. Need to. 
Okay. Very good. Wow. Yeah, so that is literally the last super. <laughs> but yeah, that was very scary. That's a you know, prime example of why those fights are really, really scary. They can be. Now this is the real scary part. It makes sure not to cancel <laughs> the evolution. <laughs> <sighs> Goodbye, m Goodbye, my mudkip. Hello, Marsh Tom. Gen 6 Marsh Tom. <sighs> that is one of the Pokemon. One of the Pokemon. One of the <laughs> Pokemon of all time. It really is. Um, and yeah, I gotta do some shopping stuff here. I'm not too sure. Yeah, just... the exact number of stuff you're buying here, but I'm sure you know, so it's not. Yeah, I got my notes. It's what I like yeah. about Ranger. It does all the math for me. Nice. Yeah, shout outs to Corva May for making the tools. Indeed. We have, uh, we have all the Gen 6 cape down there. Yeah, all of them. And a bunch of other routes from various generations as well, so. I did the, uh, I ported the X and Omega Ruby route to that, so if you use those and your notes are wrong, you can blame me. <laughs> okay. Oh, I do like it fun how there's still just some grunt still in the museum. Just, you know, taking out the art. Taking it out. Uh -huh. Thank you, Joanna. Buy a bunch of X items. Uh, oh. Yeah, extra pearls, probably. Yeah, money is actually really tight mm -hmm. in this part. For sure. I wish I could buy more potions, but. Yeah, it's really unfortunate. You had to use all your supers. Not having any for rival can be silly. Another. Having at least thing. one super potion for rival two definitely can. Mm -hmm. Hope you a lot, especially if things go poorly, but... What do you mean it's unfortunate? He is fortunate. Uh. <laughs> uh. I changed the wrong part of my name. Oh, is that another fight we fight up here to get uh, level 17? The bustles and... Minimum? Yes. And I think you can't do any damage to you. Right, yeah, they can just troll you a little bit with uh, milking your time. Or draining your time. Oh. Yep. But I think your special attack's good enough where you should probably two-shot regardless. Yeah, Maybe. I'm not too sure what it is. At least in Gen 3, they have quick attack. They can actually attack you. What is Mudkip's special attack here? Um, tw uh, special attack 25. Right now, that's level 17. Um, it's like pretty high IV. I messed up special attack specifically. It's 23 IV. Yeah. Okay, nice. You can just go plus 3 for, for a while. Yeah, so whenever your special attack is, uh, sometimes you have uh, not good enough special attack where you have to go for a range on the Grobile at plus three, or you can just go plus four. So luckily the special attack's good enough here. You can just go plus three and then uh, everything will be fine. At least I only have to use one potion. 
so. Alright. Oh, that's... This fight usually takes longer, but I've got nice speed and nice special attack. Alright. Yeah, gonna do some minion after this fight, gonna heal to full, uh, gotta throw up some repels, and probably equip the Sylph Scarf, I would think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I mean, definitely. We are really low on healing items. <laughs> Hopefully we don't have to use a potion during this fight. It'd be good. Yeah. yeah. Definitely get that save in. This fight can definitely go poorly, especially with uh Alright now, yeah. now the hard part of uh, speed running. With, uh, replace resort with Mega Drain. Maybe <laughs> good there. And then the hard part of Fogma tube running counting. Yeah. I gotta gonna go to three. plus gonna go to plus three with our specials here. One. Alright, good. Arc throw miss really fast. Oh perfect. Arden. Wow. Happening. It's no burn, please. Yeah, very good. And speed. This could be really scary because Burn is kind of just a loss situation. <laughs> you don't have super potions, so. Yeah. Yep. Oh, perfect. Good. Yep. There you go. That was yeah, a very good fight. Yeah, a, a lot fight. of hardens and rock throws. It's exactly what you want to see on that fight. And. And the range is guaranteed on Grobile here, so. Yep. This is a victory. I love victory. Me too. Make up for that disastrous uh, museum fight. Yeah, it was very good. Silly. And you get a free heal right after this. Yep, yeah, pretty helpful. Brendan is a nice guy. Give us lots of free heals. He's chaotic neutral. Mm. He'll ruin your runs, but he'll heal you right after. My least favorite uh, trainer right after this one, because I just have terrible vision. Yeah, that guy can be very annoying sometimes because you kind of just have to react to him really quickly. And it is hard so, to tell which way he's facing. Yeah, in there. yeah, exactly. Sometimes he's looking up and then he like, you know, sometimes he can be looking up and then spin all the way down. Sometimes he can be looking, you know, right, then look up and then or like. And then when he's looking up, he could like look all the way down or just look right. And he can control you a little bit there. Reacting. Pick up the bike here. Yep. Very important. And we pick up the most busted move. <laughs> Bulldoze. True. It's it's just much have a better in every way. Really? Also, I can see how tight the money is there. 58, 58 just like you. <laughs> Almost.
Yeah, I gotta do a little bit of menu in here. Gotta teach bulldoze. Uh... Yeah, equip to soft sand. Yeah, equip soft sand. Uh... Gonna turn off our experience share because that's gonna help for a little later. I don't know what my favorite Pokemon of all time is. It's, it's pretty hard. Hard question. Oh, Cyndaquil for me. Oh, I still need to get Cyndaquil plus. I've got a Typhlosion, but no Cyndaquil. Yeah. I think actually my favorite Pokemon of all time is Hood, though. Really? Yeah. Close, close, close. Yeah. Close, close, close. Very hard choice. I'm interested right. here. Seven out of Pokemon. 16 range. Oh, boy. Yeah. Type your favorite Pokemon in the chat right now. <laughs> if you can hear me, you want to type favorite Pokemon? I just want to see. I'm curious. Yeah, this range is easy. Nice. Wow, good enough. Wow. Who needs good attack? Or Zigzagoon, Lowland Vulpix, nice. Your. This, this gym bat is uh, is probably the easiest gym. It's, yeah, yeah, easily for sure. sure. Mache the entire way. Ooh, but one time you gotta click Water Gun. Ooh, that's that's hard. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> really complicates things. Metagross, not too melodic. Suian Typhlosion. I still need to play Legend Arceus. Yep. It's, true. I got it, you know, I waited in line for like hours for when it came out, and then I didn't play it. Ooh, Zatu is baseline. Oh. Speaking of Legend Arceus, uh, shout out to Halkri for beating the world record. Yeah. Well, recently? It was like the last yeah, few like, days? Yeah, this like morning. morning. Wow. Yeah. 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 I'll fasten the uh, electric. Oh. Electric. He's the chance that you just use this quick attack, anyways. Just yeah, I feel it's always. That's silly. I used to have a really long uh, USB cable. So I'd be able to like reach the bathroom from uh. <laughs> oh my god! I, really? I, I, I would use this. Yeah. Oh, I mean, I still have the twenty foot Ethernet or uh, USB cable, but it's just not practical to have it set up. <laughs> That's genius. Yeah. So you know, this you nice break here is the bathroom, and uh, get some, get a snack. Amazing. I, I disagree. I think that is practical. Genius. I just have the space to uh, have it set up. Yeah. Although I, I'm on a laptop now, though, so I can take my entire laptop with me if I need to. Oh, true. <laughs> I have done that. I I, I really need the bathroom. You know, the, just, you know, unplug the laptop, take it. <laughs> you know, if you can't have wireless control, it just have an entire wireless setup. Yeah. Or portable setup. All right, I gotta make, remember to hit Water Gun. Can't smash A. Wow, I'm just one IV short. Wait, 
of being able to uh, get the X speed. Oh, you mean outspeed the Voltor right. after XP? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. I was confused for a second. Yeah, so you got a water gun the Magnemite here to break the sturdy, and then allows you to set up afterwards. A little bit fun fact, the, uh, your XP is actually your last item used there, usually, so you can just, like, go to your last item used, and it saves you, like, a couple of inputs. I hear this is a Magneton. I had a sturdy though. Oh. Yeah, that would be tough if this had sturdy. That Magneton has supersonic. Likes using it. I feel like. Maybe it's just random, but. It doesn't even get a chance, obviously, when we X speed. Super speed tied there. Or faster, I don't know. <clears throat> Very nice to Watson down. Love to see it. Yeah, this next part's coming up. It's definitely some of the more uh, difficult execution part of this run. Boy, it terrifies me a little. Those ninja they can sneak up on you. Definitely. But also uh, here, our repel, we don't have repel up, and also we need to take rock smash, so we're going to be doing that before yep. some point. Do it right, before, right at the rock. Yeah, yeah I normally you shoot right at the rock. That way you're not really wasting that many steps. Or any steps, really. Ah. Yeah. All right, one and three for no encounter or no item. Yeah, yeah. So you're one and three here to get either get no encounter, one and three to get an item, a random item like that, or one and three to just get nothing. Uh, you know, I Ooh. I hit the movement. I still dismounted. <laughs> Very nice. Are there any items that might actually end up being useful? Uh, yeah, actually, in this in this game there is. I think you can get like an ether or something, and it can end yeah. up being. You can also get a revive and that saves you buying one. Yep, both yeah. of those are useful. Yeah, it's actually pretty cool if that happens. Although I never end up getting revived anyways, really. You could get something yeah. like a star piece and buy more, um, buy more hyper potions, but I feel like that wouldn't actually be worth it. Yeah, it's like, you never really need them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Very rarely, sometimes you heal a ton. I like to bonk on that wall to align myself. Yeah, you actually, you can bonk on the wall coming out of the cave there. Uh, and that'll allow you, you can just go straight down, bonk into the wall and then go right. And that is just like the perfect amount of space between you and the optional battle there. Yep. Allows you to skip it. Also safe for this guy because it could be tricky. Yeah, this guy can be pretty annoying sometimes. Oh, we got forty-one percent range, and um, use the X attack here. Yeah. If you get if you get paralyzed, you can just die. Like yeah, that happens Dragon to Rift. me a lot. Yeah, exactly. Uh, normally, you would just set up the X attack on the Makuhita on the fake out turn, but with our attack being as it is, we just do it right away. Uh, and that allows the Bagon here just to be a, either a guarantee. It's probably a guaranteed range now. I did, I'm not yeah, sure. Yeah, it's guaranteed. But. I guaranteed the two shot now. Wow, that, right. was a, that was a roll. <laughs> we got Lear. Yeah, and that all, Bagon's also the reason this fight can be annoying because the Bagon can use Dragon Breath and paralyze you, and then it can get really annoying on this Makuhita afterwards. Oh, you got a uh, free heal right after this. Or, not right after this, but after this fight. Oh. Alright. 
Oh. That's a 17, 16 range. Yeah. Oh well. Worst problem there is. Uh... You have this cut Do you know about secret bases? <laughs> Yeah, that force bomb there is actually pretty scary. Getting parried there, uh, be really unfortunate. Yeah, normally that's not really too big of a deal. Uh, if, you know, it's just the attack. Hard attack being is, is what it is right now. Oh. Which is not too big of a deal. Grab my stylus. <laughs> the worst. I could have Dang it. I almost put a smiley face. <laughs> uh oh. No. Yeah, so this cutscene is just like whatever. It's just mash a lot and. They wouldn't be so bad if you didn't have to mash. Yeah. If this cutscene was just like out of the way, like, you know, so much better. But you were just forced to go through it. I remember mean, Worcester when he was playing this game. I watched like one of his Oras runs. He was very upset about the secret power cutscene because like it was something about Nintendo like restricting your freedom more and more to do like what you want in the game, which is like fair, I think. Yeah, I guess so. Thank you, Brendan. Yeah, Brennan always comes in clutch with the free heals. Need him. That's what I say about the newer gens. You get all the free heals. Yeah, we had two right. free heals there with one fight in between them. Alright, you see a battle of the spelling. Neil ver a AL versus IL. Youngster Neil. Ah. Oh. Nice. That's what you call a 0 and 16 range. <laughs> oh, guys, I don't even have any super potions, too. Oh, my God. This movement right here. And that, that lady's a spinner with the umbrella there. You just have to wait for her to spin and then you go past her. Yeah, past that movement. Very nice. Yeah, so that movement's not too tough once you get used to it, but... But yeah. As long as you know where you're going, it's usually all right. Do a little bit more movement here. Fight this guy. It rocks much twice. Nothing too crazy about these pipes, really. Uh, uh, the, the fight can be kind of weird with protect and stuff. Oh, I can't even. Yeah, HP is pretty even low here. I mean, uh, uh, you could just just save before the fight. You'll be okay. Yeah. 
it's usually fast. Just not having any potions is yeah. uh, brutal. Yeah. There. I just heard enough about how uh, unfortunate things have went this run. Yeah, some optionals there. Uh, it'd be pretty that's, annoying. That's like the get. worst one yeah, to hit. You don't really know where they are. They definitely can sneak up on you really quickly and hit you there. Yeah, and that last trainer, right before you go into the cave, there's like a one tile when like a one tile uh, between you and him. That's a pretty tile perfect trick. So it's pretty cool to do that one. Are, are also pretty scary. And since we, uh, our last time we used it was, was an next attack, you just, uh, you save a menu there. Oh, yeah, nice. Yeah, no cool input. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta pay attention to the attack, too, if I get confused or not. Sorrow, right. very nice. Exactly what you want there. Mm -hmm. uh, what happens here? Snarl again, it's just completely fine. Aqua Jet range is 6 to 7. Oh. Right. Yeah, I guess that can live with certain attacks. Uh, she I just spell those, those again. again. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. I grow bollocks. Whatever. Rock Tomb, Carvana. Yes, yeah. Another spot for Rock Tomb. Nope. It does help. All the Grow value usually takes care of it. Yeah. We better take uh, care of it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's unfortunate. I was thinking, yeah, okay, Elite Blade right. anyway. That experience doesn't really matter. Not too big of a deal missing out on that XP. Oh. Yeah, it's fine. And also that puts us to full health, so. Well, we get a healed after this anyways, right? Oh, yeah. Uh, no, you don't. Normally, you would have to... Um, potion yourself, right? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, you'll not... Now yet, but regardless, now, um... will be full HP. I'm chilling. Uh, how's your defense? I don't... I mean, I remember it was My, low, so... Mm, like, a 29 minus... I don't know if you need extra. extra uh, or I, I like never get it, but I probably should for safety, right? I mean, you have bad HP, right? Yeah. Um. It's a four out of sixteen range. You kill you? Yeah, I would definitely get it. Yeah. Yeah, so there is a uh, extra X defense we can grab, and we you don't normally grab it, but whenever you have a a like a a bad defense and bad HP combination, it's uh, the Norman fight can get a little weird with him hitting you for a lot of damage, and yeah, so a safety shot where you can grab t an extra X defense and use two instead of one, and that just helps you out. Which you can only do if you go to Marvel and don't do backwards movement. So yeah. <laughs> Exactly. Back, backwards movement sucks anyways. It's fine. Yeah. <laughs> but the consistency. It's less consistent if you hit the trainer. True. But better if you get an encounter. Still get an encounter. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so either they can two out of three. There we go. Okay. Yeah, nice. That can be kind of weird. So we're going to sell our little trusty comet shard here for way too much money. Um, uh, and going to get a bunch of hypers and other useful stuff. Full heals and such.
Crash. Yep. So yeah, we got all those hyper potions and max repels. Those are literally all gonna last. That's gonna last us all the way up until uh, before Tate and Liza, I believe. So definitely. Uh, yeah, that movement's very tricky there. One tile, perfect. Another one tile. Oh my! Easy. Yeah, I mean that that hiker is really really annoying. You can just be looking a weird direction and then troll you really hard. Luckily, it didn't matter this time. So. No hiker, Easter egg. So now uh, we're going to come up on oh, these fights coming up. These fights are actually way, way better in this game than they are in Mega Ruby. Mainly because uh, of uh, Mid being Alpha Sapphire and there being Grimers here instead of Coffins. There are some benefits to Alpha Sapphire, I swear. Indeed. This fight's better. This fight's just a two shot, I believe, and then. Yeah, it's just so much better. that fight um the shelly battle is actually just so much better in this game than the tap of the battle is in omega ruby i mean I, this fight can be kind of weird in its own way but I mean, just... still i would say it's a little bit better just have x attack and bulldoze yeah this grind i'm not sure what gr this uh move grimer has but it can be a little annoying. Yeah, I know it has minimize. Hopefully we don't see that. Alright, yeah. perfect. You have to actually drop wow. though. That's fine, just hit. Yeah, so that Grimer has minimize, mud bomb, probably something else. Maybe it can poison you or something. Yeah, I've been poisoned before. Alright, good. Didn't miss, so yeah. That can be really annoying because uh, that Grimer, the way Minimize works in the game, it actually, when you get Minimize, it actually drops your, or drops its whatever, by two stages instead of one or whatever. I'm pretty sure in this game. Yeah. It would have been nice to uh, have a potion, not hyper. But. Yeah. And we'll go to the Prison Bear because uh, Mightyena has Swagger. Yeah. That's going to help us out a bunch. Yeah, so this fight is actually different on this game. I mean, he has a Golbat and a Mighty Enum, which he has in both games, but he actually has a Sharp Hito in this instead of a Camera Up. Um, yeah, oh, man. It's, 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 he has a. Say that again? 11 out of 16 range. I uh, plus two. Yeah. Although, usually, you really usually get Swagger twice. So yeah. it's like, it's never really a range. Exactly. So, um, yeah. Since there is a Sharpedo, we do need to set up two X speeds because it's actually really, really fast. So, yeah. And also, this Mighty Enid doesn't have Intimidate in this game, which it does have in Omega Ruby. So, you don't start the fight at minus one instead of. Now he's plus two. Very nice. Very well. Okay. That's, yeah, I mean, that's actually, fine. That's actually good, really. Yeah, that'll help us for sure. Feel the range, insurance. Oh. This probably won't die a plus four, it could. Ah. Uh, oh. At least we didn't get swagger. Um, that's fine. 
believe. Yep. Hit Rock Tomb. Yeah, yep. Forehead. <laughs> Only happens about 95% of the time. Very nice. It. It's actually a 3 out of 16 at plus 2, so that's what the uh, extra swagger is helpful. Yeah. Both of those would have been ranges at plus 2, probably, so definitely nice to uh, get that extra swagger in. And Omega Ruby, that extra swagger is actually like really important, like getting two swaggers instead of one. It's... Yeah, you kind of depend on it. We got a important uh, he menu after this. Yeah. I gotta remember to quit the soft sand. Especially at this range, or this attack. Yeah. Definitely. forgot <laughs> yeah so we gotta put the soft sand back on it's really important I guess you just take the old lady heal I don't remember how it works no you don't need it okay well I forgot uh, I should have healed the full actually oh well. uh, I'll do that after yeah, because sometimes your bulldoze PP can uh, be a thing here. I just didn't know how it worked, so yeah, no big deal. Yeah, I actually get to skip Swords Dance here in this game. Very nice. Time save versus Omega Ruby. Instead, you get Grass Knot later, which is similar time, I think. Yeah. Maybe not as slow because not as many text boxes. But you do got to go out of the way a little bit. Right, right. Oh, cool. These spinners can be a, a little tricky. Yeah, definitely. Can Especially there's some hidden ones there. Yeah. You don't know where they are, they definitely can sneak up on you. Yep. Yeah, I got a weird cycle on this walker, unfortunately. Oh my... Oh, oh that's bad, actually. Uh, it should be fine. One. It's fine. Right. Slugma, one shot. Slugma, See yeah. Later. See you later, buddy. Slugma notoriously good Pokemon. <laughs> did you let the berry? I wasn't looking. I Maybe did. you did. Yeah. Okay, I'm sorry. My bad. That's why I got okay. confused. Yeah, Bulldoze isn't that important. Oh, no. In this game? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, come back. There we go. A little bit lost in my notes. No, it's understandable. Yeah. Uh, there's a spinner here. Yeah, oh. Easy. Oh, that's good. <laughs> yeah, I I really don't like these spinners. They can just like spin the direction you come on. Come on. Like, oh. I don't know. Sometimes yeah, that's okay. Sometimes you just like see I don't know. You don't really expect them to look your direction and you're just anticipating to go and then you start running and then they look your direction and then Yeah. Got to react a little bit. It's probably the best optional to hit in this gym. Yeah, I. I didn't even know. Uh, yeah. Now we know. You know, I was just making up for that Miss XP earlier. You're actually. Be a little tricky sometimes, especially with my bad attack. Yeah, you definitely can get trolled with my shot misses and stuff. Understandable. Yeah, 
Yeah, Flannery, not, nothing too crazy about Flannery. Uh, Torkoal is a two-shot range sometimes, but... Uh, Spudkip's special attack's good enough, I believe, where it shouldn't be a two-shot range. Should be guaranteed. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's guaranteed. Yeah, so then what can happen is it's just you have to you have to uh, mud shot the Torkoal twice, so just a missed chance. And, you know. Usually likes going for Sunny Day or something anyway, so... All right, and I can uh, usually hit a full after this, and so I can clear that menu. Yes, I love hitting. <laughs> yeah, don't pull a me and fall back down into the puzzle under you. <laughs> I done that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Now the worst gym up next. Yeah, definitely. Outside of Brawly's right. gym, this is definitely uh, Norman's gym is definitely the worst for sure. Mary is such. Not even just yes. Norman, just like yeah, the Mary. whole fight is. Yeah, the whole gym is. Delcaddy is just. Oh, I hate Delcaddy. Ooh, all right. Delcaddy's not I mean, great, like... and Lanoon can also be kind of troll. Yeah, thankfully Dengus is much better than the originals, but. Yeah, it's actually a teleport point. It's actually really important to mash A here. Uh, yeah. That's why I match the touchpad. So you don't accidentally skip it. Yeah. You gotta, t you gotta say yes there. If you don't teleport back, I really don't know how you get to Allville, I guess. Or Pedalberg, I guess you just... Just die. You get there faster. <laughs> but like... like <laughs> mom. Wait, oh, would, would we teleport back to mom? Yeah. Genius. I, I I've died many times in this game. I know where you where your spawn points are. Yeah, Alright. Just no no attract BS please. This Del County is pretty silly. Uh -huh. Always goes for X accuracy on the first turn, and then it oh. probably will go for a track here. Or nice double slap. All right, we'll take that. Let's go. I also uh, got that in today. I completely skipped. We both completely skipped. Wow, easy. Yeah. Or, easy. Uh, a track, whatever. Yeah, yeah, you can get a track there, and then just get immobilized by love over and over and over again. Just Really unfortunate. It's the best. Or it can be, yeah. It's why if you get a, f a female mudkip, it's like a little even better. But it's one in eight, plus the already abysmal uh, chance of uh, making it that far. Just. Yeah, you can never be too careful with these gym battles. Yeah, this Lanoon. Is really, really stupid. I, I do not like this fight. Not that like it can like kill you. Really, it can just like drain your time and stuff. Like, yeah, you hit it too hard. You crit on a bad turn. It, it heals up. Like. It goes for Covet. Uh. It takes a, it takes away your soft sand. Um, and you do less damage. Nice. Yeah. So then you're forced to mud shot, and then you drop, and then after you mud shot, it's it's speed dropped by two, and then you're faster than it, and then it can just finish off the bulldoze. The annoying thing is when you get attacked over and over and over, and then you have to heal, and then yeah.
Yeah, this Zangu is actually f one fight in the game that you cannot die to. Very nice. Huh. You know, our defense is not the best, but we should we'll be fine. It's okay. Yeah. Literally, as long as you have runnable defense, you're fine on this fight. Also, just crit it instead. <laughs> right here. Uh, unfortunate. Oof. It's always scary, but like it never yeah. can kill you. Alright. Yeah, so now it's time for Norman. Time to commit some petricide. So, Norman <laughs> is... Norman is pretty much what I call this fight is just don't get crit. That's pretty much what this fight is. Um, as long as that doesn't happen, normally you're you're fine. And yeah, sometimes on this fight, uh, you can set up a, a if you have really good attack, you can set up one less X attack, and also. If you have really bad speed, sometimes you have to set up two speeds. I think I had to do that yesterday. I really remember. Yeah, but saving for Norman definitely one of these one of the fights in the run where you would definitely want to save for. Yeah, if you could you choose. Just at the threshold where you didn't have where you could have almost avoided the extra speed. Yeah. right away. Fine. Now we have to do a bunch of setup. Set up our two X defenses. Now we're gonna have to go to plus uh, four after our X speed. Yeah, go ahead and wow. heal because we're gonna have to anyways. Okay. Right, one. I got a plus four here. It's very important. Uh, that actually works out fine because now you can yeah. just wake up on this turn. Remember what this fight is called? Don't get crit. There we go. Yeah. Oh, okay, very nice. And the reason you wake up, you want to wake up on the attack. You always want to wake up on an attacking turn because you never want to give it a chance to use Yawn again. So that's just something to keep in mind on this fight. As long as you wake up on the attacking turn, you'll be fine. Yeah, when you wake up, you always want to be fully set up and waking up on the attacking turn. Blocking a ranger. Um, no, yeah, I think it's, uh, I think it's, it's like 98, 98.4. 98 98, 98, yeah. Yeah. Okay, didn't get crit. Very nice. This is apparently a range. 98.4% range. Okay. That's, okay. Pro that's probably guaranteed for sure. So. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. I got scared for a second there. <laughs> he started going a little slow. All right, very nice. Pass Norman. First try Norman. Lovely. That bike can be pretty, pretty annoying. You have to just do it all again and just reset up. Yeah. One more battle with Mudkip or yeah. Marsh. Exactly. Well, well, maybe yeah. not, but. <laughs> well. Yeah, so we're going to teach you a couple moves. We're going to teach Strength and Surf to Marsh Stomp. Uh, definitely, I'm pretty sure in this game, yeah, in this game, you want to keep Bulldoze. It's actually really important, yeah. uh, or it can be. It can just not matter at all, but definitely want to be keeping bulldoze. It depends on how. Lady S moment. Yes. Yeah. Oh, also, you need it for the double battle, the true double with Steven. Yeah. 
like the next battle. Um, but yeah. <sighs> yeah. Definitely, if you know, if you have a really really bad Latio or Latios, you can get through some backup strats that require you to have bulldoze. So. You actually have to kind of be mindful of not just teaching over it, which is what you do in Omega Ruby. I didn't have to worry about that because uh, I never play Omega Ruby. <laughs> Pretty cool game. I'll play X first. Another cool game. Also cool right. game. Built the full and teach moves. So yeah, we gotta teach surf and we gotta teach strength. Um, yeah, M Mark Snap's the only thing we have that can actually learn strength. Um, and it also just helps to have all your HMs like concentrated on one Pokemon, so that if you need it for a certain section, you can just have just that Pokemon. For example, Victory Road, this is going to be really helpful. We're going to go fight, uh... I don't know what it is, Matt? That's his name? Something like that? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that trainer always scares me. It is possible to hit him. Yeah, if you don't hug the bottom, you can, you can hit you, yeah. Oh man, Latios. I sure love to use Latios. What, is it? what a cool Pokemon. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh well, too bad. There's no way. Just, what, uh, if you, what if you could just use Kyogre and Omega Ruby? It'd be the best oh, okay. game ever. <laughs> or is that ROM hack? <laughs> Yeah, so if you only play the originals here, you might be surprised to see where we're going here. Because this none of this was ever in the original games. Um, you got Steven would talk to you and then he would say something like, Oh, you're making progress or whatever, and then he would just leave. Time for the best Pokemon? Oh uh, yeah. Well everybody's favorite? Red means it means faster, right? Red is fast. Yep, the pigment red, just yep, saves time. That's why all my Pokemon are blue in this game. Wait. This is where we don't get swagger. Oh. Cringe. This could be a one turn fight, theoretically. Easy. All right. Could be. All right, easy. Close. Oh. All right. Yeah. Oh, wow. Good fight. Oh. Not bad. Uh, saw that. Let's just get like a, let's just get like a like a modest or you know, like a mild. Yeah, or... my... I mean, you saw the stats. My last Latias, <laughs> plus thirty one speed, thir yeah. thirty one special attack. Speed. Latias saw that 
that fight and was like, wow, this is a trainer I can be proud of. Get your nature yeah. really guesses good. in. Get your nature guesses in right here. Definitely, I'm definitely feeling, you know, a, a good nature. Whether it's plus speed or plus special oh. attack, I don't know. I didn't mean to mean a nickname, but whatever. Hi. Yeah, Hi. nice. I like that. Uh, you know, it's gotta say be friendly. You know, if you're if you're friendly <laughs> to the laddie ass, uh... exactly. Maybe that's the reason nobody gets good stats. They just don't yeah, name they're it. too mean to laddie ass. Always, <laughs> always bringing it down. Think it's not good. True, laddie ass is the best Pokemon. Exactly. Alright. Sorry, I had to lie to you all. I'm sorry. <laughs> Right. Those are the anticipation. Uh, I can grab your stats, so don't worry too hard about it. Yeah. Or if you grab them, just do whatever you do normally. Yeah, I have a Grimshot tool. Whatever. Yeah. Well, I did use OBS. For... A good strat. Yeah, so a pro tip for anybody who wants to run this game, or anybody who does run this game but doesn't do this, good strat to do here whenever you teach a move any of your Pokemon, get a screenshot tool ready or something, and simply screenshot whenever you teach your moves like this, because all your stats pop up and your nature pops up right here. Yeah, that's a good yeah, nature. Nice. Oh. Very nice. Let's go. Naive, right. right? Naive, yep. That's actually really good. It's actually good special. I think it's... 80, that's, that's new. One. That's 31, yeah. Yeah, it's 31. Let's go. I'll have to... Okay. I'm gonna pick up some items here as well. So it goes, it goes straight from just getting your Latias into just a bunch of execution really quickly. Yeah, it's actually kind of annoying because you don't really get a chance to put your stats. Oh, it's a little annoying. Oh, by the kid. <laughs> yeah, I gotta go over here, grab this elixir. Oh. The boy's just observing you. Yeah, I was actually kind of scared. I for didn't know. <laughs> um. Okay. Yeah, that's kind of unfortunate. And I, I think you're yeah, gonna grab the PP Max for safety. Yeah, I mean, I'm. I, I respect this. You can get really cool in a later fight if you don't have the PP Max. Yeah, okay, but already did our minis and stuff, so we get to just go right into the battles. And yeah, if you want your stats, I can tell you unless you have them. I got them. Okay, cool. Right, it's a very good Latias. Very, very good. Love to see it. Oh, wait. They're going to get right into it with Latias. Uh, so the main difference between Latias and Latias oh, is this. damn it. Lati no, um, oh, come on. Oh. I'm being punished hard. Oh, my God. No. I did 18 with the crit. <laughs> nice. All right. Um, uh, surf count doesn't matter. We're killing. No. Um, yeah, you're good. Yeah, so getting minimized in this game is actually really... Normally that grammar just dies in uh, one hit to miss ball, but it's unfortunate misclick. I miss him putting my stats too, that was... Yeah. All good, man. Um... Oh, the... This was a, a good laddie ass. Indeed. Yeah, so the main difference between Latios and Latios is uh, mainly Latios is just obviously more bulky, and then 
Atios is more uh, offensive, I guess. Yep. Yeah, this fight can definitely be kind of cringe, so yeah, definitely want to save here. Sharpedoes are just always so cringe. Yeah, like, the Sharpedoes is, is, are literally what make this game just so much worse. Yeah. Obviously, Latias oh. isn't great, but... Although, at least it's not a range, but you can still get frozen, basically. Yeah, it usually likes going for scary face if you're fast. Oh, that's a great oh, pair. That's, yeah, that's a great really fight. Good, wow. Really good pair, yeah. Yeah, yeah that's so sick. It always goes for scary face when you're faster than it. Uh, you still so have yeah, prism can... too, right? Yeah. 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 Wow. Yeah. So being able to keep, um, keep the prism, get scary face, and don't even give it a chance to hit you. Is very. True. And I don't have to heal too. Yeah. So I don't think it's the menu, right? Spatias is like cracked. I mean, uh, I've seen better. <laughs> uh, no, it's very really good though. Bro, it, has, it has three, it has four 30 to 31 IVs. Yeah. Crazy. Of course, well, one, one of them is passive like... defense, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> Yeah. Your speed's also really good too, even, you know. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, having a really bad Latias, you, there's situations where you have to do some backup strats, and luckily we're not going to have to do those. Very nice, exactly what you want. We're going to make save up a lot of time there. You're gonna set up. No, you're not gonna set up on this. No, I don't have any setup to do. Yeah. Yeah. yeah okay. I was thinking about something different. Dude, doesn't really do anything. These fights, there's not really. Yeah. Yeah. For some reason, Brendan only still has three Pokemon on his team, but. I mean, okay. we're, fine. we're doing much better. <laughs> More section of cutscenes. Yep. A lot to provide no trouble for movement with bikes. Yep, yeah, just gonna do some Steven stuff. Doesn't do crazy. Um, we are gonna have to get a move that you don't normally get in Al or Omega Ruby. It's behind uh, the gym. When yeah, it's behind Winona's gym. Grass knot. Yeah. <clears throat> just really need it. Just, just a really good move. Helps a lot for mainly the Sharpedos. Of course. All comes back to the Sharpedos. Mm
All right, I'm gonna get a uh, grass knot here. Well, first gotta. Yeah, I gotta encounter this or get rid of this Kecleon. There are some uh, annoying spinners in this gym. Yeah, definitely this puzzle can be kind of weird. But yeah, again, if, if you don't really rush the spinners in this game, not really too risky. Ooh, Very okay. nice. Actually, really nice. Uh, really nice cycles. You actually hug the bottom there, the trainer can't see right. you. Yeah, exactly. Very nice. Did you ever, did you ever uh, PB Max Miss Ball? No, not yet. No. I should have done that in a minute. I used that before Brennan 4. Or... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, you're right. You're right. I just got to mix up. It's a plus two. Oh. Uh, do I want to... Nah, I'm going to I'm gonna be safe and go for three special attacks. You know, stress at 6 and 10 at 16 ranges. Yeah, you can guarantee the range. Not the worst. <sighs> okay. yeah, this fight is really uh, go go plus 4 or plus 6 or whatever. I'm thinking of which you know, go plus 3 or go plus 2. Yeah. And, uh, there we go. Then just hit, yeah, because the Swellow can just sit there and spam double team and it can get really annoying. Yeah. After that, it's just a victory. Really, the Swellow, that's the problem. Assuming you're getting all the ranges, which we are. Hope you see it. You get a free heal right after this, so you know. Yeah. Not exactly. worry about PP or health. Yep. 100%. Not gonna have to do anything crazy either, just get to do normal stuff. Our Latias is so good. I'm not gonna show up any of all the backup strats. <laughs> yeah, there is a couple backup strats where you can go for some rare candies that are a little out of the way. But, uh, yeah. Oh, this movement's my most satisfying, to be honest. You go, just cut through all the grass. Mm -hmm. And I for once remembered to set my date. Are they? I don't know. Okay. Very nice. Yeah, it's so satisfying just cutting through all this grass. <laughs> There's a, a trainer here that's a, a bit annoying. Indeed, quite annoying. Very nice. I always like doing that movement. When you come out of here and this lady is just sitting here, perfectly placed, free heal at the perfect time for the, the run. 
It's actually crazy how good it is. Perfectly there. Let's finish our PP full health. Uh, still. Yeah, this is it's still. Even though I've gotten 31 special attacks, and it's not positive nature, it still ranges here. Oh, yeah, true. What's a range, actually? <laughs> Rhymer? Yeah, the grammar. <laughs> yeah, my mount pirates is one of the most annoying parts of Eladias. So much can go wrong if you especially yeah. had one. Definitely, <clears throat> definitely a lot of variants on Mount Mount Pyre with the Mighty Innas. Not only the Mighty Innas, but the Sharpedo fight too. So, I'm just, I'm just gonna hit the uh, the range. No big deal. Yeah. Is it eleven sixteen? Ah. Ah. All right. Easy. Yeah, it makes up for <laughs> the, those ones earlier. Evens out. Hmm. No rare candies to be used. All right. Alright, I'll need to remember to use the, uh, PP Max. Yeah. After on the main menu. Like... Yeah. Maybe you... Or between... Whatever and Matt. Alright. Good embargo. I'd like to see it. Oh uh, my... Silly. That's a range? Oh my god. Oh my... Uh, uh, probably just... That's probably within... Oh... Uh... All right. Easy snap. Not, Easy snap. Yeah, never punished. <laughs> I didn't even. Ah, oh, that's so. <laughs> oh, they have to uh, menu here. So. That being our last hyper, I'm gonna maybe consider yeah. grabbing the well, floor store. Uh, I mean, it could be fine. We'll see. Hopefully, this fight just goes well. Might want to try to save a Serp here, too, I feel like. Yeah, I definitely can yeah. drag him. Uh, yeah. Probably slower than this now, which is really unfortunate. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna save. But, oh, especially since I don't have um, have any healing. Yeah, definitely understandable for sure. <laughs> Next fight is really. Silly. This is a bad fight, yeah. Um. Oh, I forgot. Wait, uh... Oh, I was supposed to menu. Oh, no. Um... I uh, probably just soft reset. You didn't teach yeah. Grass Knot? Yeah. Grass Knot. You actually teach Fly and Grass Knot on this menu since you're faster, right? Uh... Are you faster? Yes. Yeah, you have really good speed. Definitely faster. Yeah, so that was unfortunate, uh... And I actually didn't notice it either, so. No 
no big deal. And these grass knot that we picked up earlier, it's gonna help us for this fight specifically. And other fights after, but really, really helps for this fight. Yeah, so normally, or not normally, but if you have a really bad speed of Atias, you would have to swap Marshawn to the front here, lead Bulldoze to drop the Carvana speed, and then swap into Latio or Latias and then finish the fight that way. But now that our special attack's really good, I believe probably should just be a guaranteed Grass Knot plus Surf. Not sure what level you are, but... 33? Yeah, so it should be guaranteed. Grass not plus surf here, right? Yeah. Yeah. Fair enough. Yeah, so this fight's gonna go is he's gonna... Grass not here, and then after we grass not, it's gonna... Since we're faster, it's gonna go for... Scary face, unfortunately. Because it likes being faster than you, and then... Now it's gonna go for Ice Fang. Just... Oh, Woo! okay. Okay. Yeah. Easy. Wasn't this thing is scary. Way, right? Yeah, that fight is so bad. So fun fact, World Record actually dies on that fight, which is... Yeah. Just shows like how silly that fight can be. Mm. Uh, since I don't have any healing, I'm gonna have to, uh... If... Yeah, you can just full restore after you buy them. No big deal. Uh, oh yeah. Alright. I think I got that extra money from finding that option, all right? Um. I'm gonna have to get the rare candy. How many warp stores are we gonna be able to get here? Because we're out of. Yeah, so this is a rare candy that we can grab. It can help a lot. Uh, especially for this, it probably guarantees the mat range in the hideout, yeah. I would say, or makes it very, very likely. It's very nice to make that guaranteed, or even more favored. Yeah, gonna do some shopping here, gonna buy a couple X beads. Um, um, X specials. And a guard spec that we're going to use on Archie a little later. Mm. <clears throat> Running low on max spells, need some more of those. I think this is the only game, uh, only shop in the game where you can buy X items. So this is yeah, kind of kind of got to stock up when you come here. Mm -hmm. That should be fine. That should be able to get a C four at least. Yeah. If it doesn't, we're gonna have a lot more problems than that. <laughs> no, I mean, we can just buy some at some point. If the worst comes to worst. Yeah. I mean, you've had to heal a lot. It's just unfortunate all around. Yeah. But yeah. Still looking good here now, though, that we. We're full HP and we have that extra rare candy for Matt. Just no Sharpedo. Yeah. These fights are pretty straightforward, nothing too crazy about them. Yep. Start for a couple times. Yeah, so like if you have a bad Latias, you, you can really struggle with some of these fights, so just you know, no one shot things. Hmm. 
Uh, 9 and 16 range coming up. Alright, no big deal. Good roll, scary face. Why is it doing that a lot? Ooh. Yeah, the Mighty Innis have not been nice this run at all. At all. At least it's, uh, Caravana's not a range. No. True. Yep. <clears> that is something. Let me get Rival go and then Rival play it too. It's a bad uh, so It looks like the mat range with this rare candy will be a 13 and 16. No, that's not too bad. Yeah, I definitely will take that. Uh, yes, yeah, Carmona always dies. Rough skin, unfortunately, but that's we can't really avoid that. Golbat is a nine and sixteen. Hopefully, we can just get the range. One time ever. Never. Uh, uh, that's fine. Yeah, we're good. We're good. All right. Probably had to okay. yell anyway, it's cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta make sure to say yes. Yeah. Soon. For sure. Brendan for nothing but pain. <laughs> yeah, so this is another uh, reason why uh, the people like getting the PP Max for this fight uh, specifically, really. Uh, it can come in handy, it basically helps you have to not hit a fly on the Sceptile. Going for fly is obviously not the fastest because it's multiple turns, but also the Sceptile can just uh, protect, or I mean, it can detect. Just block it anyways and just force you to do it again where if you have multiple miss balls extra miss balls which you have with the pp max you can just miss ball twice i believe yeah i, I just don't, don't really remember just top of my head, but I, yeah yeah Yeah. Looking like with our speed here, we shouldn't have to set up an X speed. Probably just go to plus one and then yeah, be able that's to what go. Do. Yeah. It's great because you know another swallow. <laughs> yeah. Loves to use a double team. The less turns you give swallow, the better, really. So we can just you know get lucky. All right. Easy. Very nice. Yeah, hopefully Septel plays nice here. Yep. There's the detect. Unfortunately. I think we have plenty of miss balls. Right. Right. Ready. Detect again. Um. Really silly. We'll try. Oh That's fine. Yeah, we're good. We're good. We're good. Yeah. yeah, nice. Uh. Uh, I don't remember what. You, what yeah, I don't remember what you do with your uh, PP situation here. Do you just? Is it if you have none left, then you use um, the el oh. full healing elixir, but you only need one more that before you. Um... Oh, so you have your Lepa Berry still? Um, no, you use the elixir after the first Aku Grunt fight. Okay. Yeah, or... Oh, so you're not gonna elixir here? No, are you no, because I have still have one mythball Ball left. I, can I thought I just saw zero. Door. Is that crazy? No, nah, nah, I've got one. No, yeah, you do have one, yeah. <clears throat> God, that makes sense. Then I guess you just get the Victor Road Elixir, or you have any Lepas left? I, don't I, know. I have Lepas, yeah. Okay, okay. That makes more sense. I always remember this part of the game being kind of weird with the, your PP situation. Not like yours specifically, I'm just saying like in general with the route. I think your experience, right, with Elvis Sapphire is still kind of up in the air. Never really yeah. resolved. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Yeah, makes sense.
And I think I'm gonna save. I don't think it's a range, but you know, I didn't free. I'm not exactly sure. Just fight. A range to what? Two shot? I shouldn't be a range with this ball, but my notes aren't the most verbose over both, so. I think it sure. might be a range. <laughs> Let me look. Now it's in this ball. Uh, hmm. Yeah, yeah. I didn't. I didn't remember. I mean, I. I didn't. You know, I just didn't remember at all. And then we menu. Yeah. So it's very nice there. The fact that you have a missed wall left, because now oh. you just delay your menu by one, one fight, and you can just heal the full here and then replenish your PP. Now your sheriffs are good and your uh, missed balls are good, so you don't have to worry about that at all anymore. You just gotta dodge some trainers here. Yep. It was a 6 and 16 range. <laughs> <laughs> Easy. Yeah. yeah. The uh, a mirror of the magma hideout, pretty much. You get to talk Except to the tree. I love you, just get to touch grass. To touch grass, yeah. <laughs> <gasps> Imagine. Wow. Amazing. <laughs> yep, now we have, uh, Mighty Anna fight, another Mighty Anna. Well, five Mighty Annas, really. <laughs> believe it's the last Mighty Anna. Oh, true. <laughs> this fight. I don't really... actually in her mind. Yeah. I don't remember what this Mighty Anna can do. I don't think it's too scary, though. Nah, I just. I don't know if it has. Probably has scary base embargo. <laughs> Why are they doing that? Oh, I, don't I think know. everybody is like using assurance, like with every single one. Uh, they just don't so want me to have uh, potions. Literally, I'm starting to get. I want them to be. I want to have a lot of those. Yep, this is the uh laggiest battle of the game. <laughs> if only the new 3DS was out when this game came out. Yeah. Take advantage of the hard right? Do they want to skip the heal? Go for the range? <laughs> Wait, did you use the candy? No, not yet. About to. Oh, use it now? Okay. Oh, makes sense. Yeah, I don't think it really nah. matters. Alright. Oh, I'm gonna. The savings. Yeah, makes sense. I'll save first, and if I need to he restart, then I'll heal. So... Yeah, it's all good. As long as I just need to save. I can just save, uh, you know, one potion. Simply get the range. It'll be good. Yeah. Yeah. You know, thir 13 out of 16. So likely. Yeah, so this, this is another fight. Why Mighty or why the Sharpedos just suck so bad. Yeah, with, just, the, with again, the. Again, he, you're faster than it, so it's gonna go for Scary Face right away. And if you don't get the range, and then it gives it a chance to use Ice Fang. And then if it, like. 
either crit you, punch you, freeze you. Like. Don't Actually, I think you, I feel like you're not faster than Sharpedo oh. like almost all the time. <laughs> no, you're not. You're well, not faster. Not all the time, but in this area. We I this like one that. is. Yeah, I was gonna say because most Latiasses really struggle with this fight like a lot. Yep. But I. Uh, I got. To, I just simply get the crit, so you know. Yeah. Enough. Oh. But your HP right now, like 60? Yeah, I'm gonna have to heal anyway. There. On Tate and Liza. Uh, it's Liza and Tate in this game, actually. Alright, uh, you're right, yeah. yeah. Nope. It's t so annoying. Yeah, that, that part can be kind of silly, the corners. You don't think you're near them and then you just get off. This gym is... Yeah, it's just some, it's like, it's a little scary for me, just the movement. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Definitely not free movement. Actively thinking about where you're going and stuff. Um, yeah, that was a little awkward. <laughs> That's true, here. Yeah, this takes a spinner. Enough, there we go. Great gym design, no uh, mandatory trainers at all. Nope. Oh, like 40 something, yeah. I was thinking maybe you could have gotten away with not healing, but... Oh god. Alright. This region is scary, but... Yeah, we're good. Yeah, so Tate Liza, pretty straightforward. Basically, they don't have terrible special attack. Yeah, exactly. Um, ideally, you don't hit the. Or ideally, you're you're you're. So what you want is your marsh stop not to die on turn one. That's what you want. If that happens, then the fight was probably good. Not that it matters if it dies or not, because it can and. It... It's to skip all the swapping in stuff. Alright. Solar Beam Psychic. Well, uh, oh well. I mean, yeah, no big deal. Another X special attack, and yeah, so that's why Marshall died on turn one. Kind of stinks because Cast Form always dies as well. Right. Oh. 
And just like that, we're getting really close to being done with Latias, so... Love to see it. Yeah, not, not a bad section at all. <laughs> yeah, definitely we'll take it. Now the, the longest splits. <laughs> like... Yeah, this one. Let's next two definitely can drag a little bit. Another little cutscene. Yep. What's the mashing here? Nothing too crazy. Yeah, t and then teach dive. Yeah. Do this. Sure. At least I don't have to heal a lot of ass. Yeah, it's really clutch that every uh, Pokemon you get in this game just learn the TMs, and HMs. Very, very nice. I am going to save it for the grunt because it's just... It can just kill you. It's just... Yeah, the muck is... Yeah, very, very silly. <laughs> Yeah, gotta do some things here. Gotta teach dive mostly, or main, mainly. The mark stop is also dead. That's actually important. If it stays that way. It's like to hug the little dark blue part. Yep. A little part that you can literally hug the this. And also, if you somehow get lost, uh, you can literally just look at the bottom screen and basically just know where to go. Pretty neat trick. I got the movement and I still dismount though. I gotta have that's, more pace yeah. to myself. Yeah, that, that spinner can be kind of scary there and getting through the, the little things. Like getting through a little like one tile wide thing Yeah. on the bike <laughs> is not as awkward. Very fun. Good game. It could be worse. It could be BDSP. True. The muck is be annoying. Could get poisoned and just minimize. Yep. We get something good. Gonna get assurance again. I mean, yeah. Hello, friend. Oh, wow. Very nice, finally. <laughs> <laughs> I imagine that happened on all of them. Oh. More importantly, though, what is this gonna do? Yeah. Alright. Should definitely die in two hits, but it can. Don't do the thing? 
Perfect. Nice. This is great. Oh. And I don't have, don't have the menu. Nope. Day before our sheen. Really, that you even have to stay for Archie because it's just a completely. It should be a completely free fight, but sometimes he just embargo goes for him, first yeah. turn. Yeah, sometimes he goes for embargo and he just ruins the fight. Left boulder, of course. Nice. Who's Hypotic? Yeah. Aim for Archie because, yeah, Embargo exists. Oh. I got a 15 and 16 range on Mighty Net plus 2. Wow. Very nice. And you can't really die if you miss that either. That's always good right. loading. Yeah, the important range is not bad. Yeah, every, I mean, I'm sure everything else does. Sure. Yeah, he's a guard spec, because... Next use taunt. Or not taunt, but a swagger. Not swagger, what am I saying? Okay, face. Yeah, so we're going to yeah. set up a guard spec here. That's why we bought the guard spec earlier. Ideally, he just sits here and spams scary face because he wants to be faster than you. Wow. And embargo first turn. <laughs> That's why we saved. That was really stupid. It's, getting an embargo is very, very unlikely. Yep. Yeah. Very unlucky to see embargo there. We just get to hear the theme again. It's you know, it's always great. I love this theme. Yeah, so let's try this again. Gonna guard spec. Alright. Carry base, exactly how it should normally go. Let's yeah. Just better XP to be faster. Did something. Probably Sharpedo. Robat. Uh, and then we gotta go to plus two. Yeah, there here. we go. Alright. Yeah. And. Very good. Alright. Yeah, let's go. Alright, 10 out of 6. Or, no, actually. No, every, uh, you're good. Everything right. does. Yeah. 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 Yeah, this is the last fight with Latios. Definitely uh, did his job for us. Not complain too much. He did a nice little cutting break. Uh -huh. True. Oh, I, I actually don't know exactly where the break is. I need to figure that out. Uh, it starts like sometime when I don't I can't really explain it. Whenever you're walking with Archie, probably. Towards uh, Ogre. Yeah, but this cutscene or this split actually has two cutscenes here. Uh, this one's probably about a minute, and then there's one uh, after you catch Kyogre. About two minutes.
Yeah, so it starts right here. Uh, but actually, run real quick. Hello, chat. What is up? What's up? When is it nap time? Take a quick nap right now. Dirty Thunder? Wow. I was first. Wow, imagine Anna and Cooker. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Close. For Screech Kyogre, that's right. Now I get to listen to the good music. Interesting Rand Runner. Yeah, so, yeah, this split is really, it's funny because it's probably the longest split on the game, and yet there's... <laughs> no fights. Yeah. <laughs> or one at the very end. Why, well, my split's different. I actually have a split for after Kyogre. I don't know why. It's so, it's not like, it's super long between yeah. splits. A lot of mashing here. Means you can mash at the touch screen and save your uh, your fingers and just use your wrist. My favorite burb. Oh. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Right, I always like I, I always like doing the cutscenes to lay down the DS and like I can mash like nicely that way. And it saves my hands a little bit. But he did that the whole time. Because <laughs> I can't I can't do the movement like that. We're not yeah, poke yeah. guy. Yeah. Like, I can't control- there's no way I could control the, the joystick with like my pointer finger. There's no <laughs> way. There's no way. What you do is you lay half of it on the, you know, your right side of it on the desk, and the left side hanging up. Oh man. Yeah. That's something. Let's see. Yeah. The rain beam is very good. The only reason to play this game. Exactly. One thing I'll give it over, Mega Ruby. Oh, this game's pretty fun. Yeah. My favorite, my favorite Pokemon game, to be honest. Yeah, Ores is a really fun game, for sure. Both of them. At least I enjoyed it. Maybe it's because mostly the nostalgia, but even then, they're still pretty good games. Next PSR marathon next year, we'll uh, hopefully get to see some Scarlet Violet. Yeah, hopefully Scarlet Violet's the best speed game in PSR. <laughs> no, that's that's Ultra Moon. Come on, forever and ever. We don't know that. What if Scarlet? What if Scarlet Violet does have the world record in that? 
What if Scarlet Violet just transcends all expectations and it's just, you know? Yeah, it could. Never know. I'm optimistic. I'm cautiously optimistic. Ultra Moon is also a very good speed. Yeah. <laughs> Curious on how the co op is going to work out. See if a co op speed run might be possible. Yeah. Oh, yeah, they definitely will definitely. be, I think, for sure. Hopefully. Should be pretty cool. Yeah, but yeah, it, it's hard to tell whenever we don't really know how that's going to work. Well, I wish sure I got my float tower set up, you know, to catch Kyogre. <laughs> Well, most times a cutscene. Well, one cutscene, I should say. Yeah. Do that part though, at least. Do some catch them all marathon next. Hey, sounds great. You know, I did start routing. Uh, like some short fire as well. Catch them all. Wow, interesting. And by start, I mean I spent like ten minutes on it, or not. <sighs> I bet they got all the available Pokemon in their locations. <laughs> I mean, how bad could it be, right? <laughs> It'd be that bad. Or is it the Palma run? Alright, good special attacking speed, come on. Yeah, hopefully. Give me the modest. I mean, I would probably say, I'm not sure, but I would say it's probably the same as Groudon. Like, the best would probably be like a max speed than 31 IV neutral special attack. Yeah. Oh, I, I think special really, attack is better. Than yeah, I don't really attack. remember, though. Yeah. I think Maybe I've, uh... Uh, Glacia. I have one less chance of getting sheer colded. Yeah. Fair enough. <laughs> but you gotta remember, there's actually a tiny bit of movement you have to do. Yeah, from one side to the other. Alright, just three more minutes before we catch the Kyber. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, plus special attack nature is probably the best for sure. Kyogre time. All right, another cutscene. <laughs> yeah, one is, you know, skipping Master Ball, skip a quick ball, to catch Kyogre. <laughs> <laughs> For your world record, right? Literally, yeah. I, I wonder if how much time to save that would be. Oh, We'd have uh, to completely reroute the game because of all the mess XP. Probably. Well, 
I mean, no, it, it would be fine. Nah. You would just you complete. You just wouldn't go get the master ball, and you would buy a quick ball somewhere. Well, thing for the Luthen Tate fight. I don't, know, I don't know how that'd be. I think. You'd probably have to also have uh, Marshall survive turn one as well. You can use another special attack. Congrats on Kyogre. Good Pokemon. Very good Pokemon, in fact. Hello. Hi and hello. Another cutscene. <laughs> If you think this is a longer cutscene. More cutscene. Let's go. Hopefully I don't mess up the last uh, real cut scene of the game, puzzle. Though. Three times. Yeah, now it's the last oh, cutscene. got this. <laughs> no 10 minute uh, credit sequence. Alright. Scoot off. Is it a little stretch? Yeah, it's always a nice time to... When you're on, this, when you're on, you know, check socials when you're on a run. <laughs> yeah. This is where Power Off Sapphire just like really <laughs> cruises. Yeah. So we're gonna do some stuff here with Kyogre. Teach some moves. He's Hopefully we have a good one. We'll... You think he's call mine instead of us? We'll look at your stats. You have to move the Mystic Water. Oh, oh it's not necessary. Yeah. Yeah. Um, let's see. I'm gonna see my special attack is first. Or do I even do I still have a prism barrel left? I don't even know. Uh, uh not sure. I don't remember when you I think I'm we'll see when, when I have you, to go on the menu. You probably need the squatter, more than likely, but yeah. Yeah. It makes the ranges nicer anyways. And I don't know if you have Persia, maybe you do, I don't know. Yeah, you're lucky us to have it, so it's probably on cast form. Oh yeah, it is. Yeah. I just need to see if I have plus seven. Right. Yeah. I'll look and see. That's our Mon. Back Ekman. The anticipation is killing. <laughs> True. The split really drags. It's just a lot of mashing.
But it's always nice when we get done with it because oh boy, it's happening. I'm gonna teach surf. Ooh. Uh, okay. Uh, that's 31, quiet. right? I think it's 31 speed. Why? Oh, damn. 163 is a lot of commercial attack. That's good. I'm going to. Yeah, you can skip the putting the mist water on right now, I guess. But I don't know if the. Yeah, should be fine. Actually. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So when you have really, really good special attack, you actually can just skip put it on the mist water altogether. Yeah, I'm not sure. Uh, the special attack's not 31. Yeah, special attack's really good though. No, but it's 25, 26. Yeah, it's really good. Yeah, so yeah, Surf on Love This Is Guaranteed, which is all you really care about. But Ekman, it's the same as the attack for Groudon. Very nice. The <sighs> game. Well, now I can put my stats here. <laughs> um... B is uh, a little dicey, but. Oh well. He's fine. He's not to worry about confusion. And I messed up the uh, gym puzzle. Which I messed up three times on my PP, so it's already looking good. <laughs> I mean, you're 31 speed, so I think it's actually okay. Yeah. For the most part. Like, I don't think it matters. Yeah, either. I don't think it matters too much. If it's 31, yeah, it actually should. Right. Some god item. Thank goodness, that's... Yeah, so normally, if your special act's not good enough, you have to just have the Mystic Water on, and then just hit through Confusion there. I think we probably have to hit one less Origin Pulse, I would assume, in this case, because we've saved the turn. Um, it's either if it's raining, then I can use Surf. But I'm gonna have to hit an Orange Impulse anyways. I think you only have to hit one though, which is nice. Yeah. You gotta hit two, right? No, but he saved the turn. Oh, we know. Oh, rain's gone already. Uh, oh, oh, it's well, back. It's <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Thank you. <laughs> okay, thanks. We still got an orange pulse again, I guess. Yeah, you can one shot the my loader. Maybe you can one shot it, yeah. Yeah, it's raining. Uh, either way, it's just it's X2. Or time next, but uh, no, it is. Shouldn't be range. Oh. Yeah, well, I guess we can serve times too, and we can, yeah, yeah, be safe gamers. Let's go. Yeah, Orange Pulse could potentially kill there from one shot, but not too big of a deal. Orange Pulse can miss, so. 85% accurate, not great. Exactly. Yeah, so. Gonna yeah. need to equip the Mystic Water now. And at some teach point. Waterfall. Yeah, you can just, just teach Waterfall, then just move the Mystic Water over. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. 
I actually golded that split too. Whoa. Very nice. I think this could be personal best pace, maybe. Eventually, well, yeah. Uh, I'm not gonna say anything. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I'm uh, 47 seconds ahead, but I lost a lot of time in Victory Road, so... Yeah. I'm actually surprised I am only... I'm not that far behind. Because of my god Latias. Yeah, it was a very nice Latias. Alright, I didn't... My... This thing was a little scary. A lot of the... Parents. Yeah, this movement can be a little trickier. Yep. It's important to make sure that Marsh Stomp stays dead. Right. Also, another benefit of Sapphire is Kyogre is a faster swimmer. So you want uh, Marshomp to stay dead, so you can skip double battles, but you also need Marshomp in your party to skip, or to have to use strength and stuff, so. And you only use Waterfall once to get even get to Victory Road. That's where you teach it. And there's a rotator up here that, yeah. oh, as long as you hug the wall, it can't hit you. Yeah. Right around them, be nice. This can be a little tricky sometimes, but this should be good. Yeah, this frost last can be kind of weird. All right, perfect. All right, surf within our range coming up. Perfect. Got a light shining in me, so it's even harder to see. Yeah, this... Not too dark in here, but like it can be kind of awkward when you're looking at it on the 3ds screen. I, you know, it, I it, looks, it looks it looks easier than it looks whenever you're looking at it on like on the game, like when you're watching it. But when you're actually doing it, it seems it's just a lot darker than it looks. Pretty tough to see in there. Thanks for the good luck. Mm 
you need, do you need this elixir or no? Sometimes, no. Sometimes, okay. Yeah, sometimes there's routes where you need this elixir. It, it's really convenient though because it's just it just happens to be um, right after this fight if you do need it. Nice. Yeah, I knew there was a trainer coming up, so it's it wasn't yeah. exactly. Yeah. The double battle there that you you, you don't actually need. You can skip it either way, but it's like faster to just bike through there. Yeah. Very important that your marsh top is dead throughout this victory road. The thing about all these pokes in this game is you can actually one-shot them. Yeah. Uh, you can't do that with Groudon, which is pretty cool. Unless you get Endure like that. It's just so broken to have, like, something like, like your brain actually boosts, like, your type. <laughs> like, it boosts your stab move I and know. it boosts the attacks that you usually use, so. I know, imagine, crazy. Yeah. <laughs> and this is why we have March on Fainted. Alright. What a concept I know. That spinner right there is actually the last uh, spinner slash optional, potential optional battle. Uh, save before Wally. Yeah, assuming you have your March on dead and you can just get past that double battle like that. So. Yeah, the Magneton could be a little bit scary sometimes here. Alright, just six fights left in the game. True. Let's see what are the what are the ranges here? None. Oh, perfect. You can just surf. Yep. Yep. Put a plus two. Everything. I mean, I could go only call my one to go for origin pulse, but uh -huh. I ain't doing scary. that. I wonder how close plus one surf comes to killing. Well, wow. good question. Might I'm be ready. Yeah. yeah. An ice beam. Yeah. Really good. Derp an ice beam and calm mine is just beautiful. I always have a time save because I got uh sheer colded in my people. Oh yeah. I did I did see that. So Sydney is gonna be what you probably need to X speed at least once, I'd say, with this speed. Uh yeah. I don't think you need to well, set up at all with the special attack, right, Shirley? No, I do not. Yeah, probably just need to X speed. I don't know, I guess you could potentially do it on take out turn. Mm -hmm. This is Maybe. I am on really good I am on PV pace now. <laughs> nice. Oh, uh, that was a gold split too. Whoa! Be a nice way to finish yeah. off the marathon, you know, with a PB run in a marathon. Pretty hype. Oh, yeah. yeah. So we're gonna do some more PC in here. Gonna uh, actually get rid of our Marsh Stomp. Uh, do you need four stores? I'm not sure if you need them. I I should be good. Should be. Yeah, I'd say if you have, you know. Like at least like four. I should have four, yeah. Five uh, maybe. I did get to save a bunch too. So depends what happens on champ because you can get trolled. But you shouldn't ha you shouldn't have to set up too much on champ because you have really good special attacks. Double toxic, right? 
Yeah, yeah. Remember it's a PC hill. Very nice. Although I forgot to do it once. It was a terrible. I, I ran out of PP on champ and had to teach a move. Yeah, I somehow managed though to be to finish the game. But Yeah, so Sydney, uh Sydney's kind of, Sydney can be kinda of weird, but if you have Ideal, I mean, the ideal is you know you don't you don't really have to set up if you have really good special attack. Only, only way you have to set up is if you have like not that good. And yeah, the mighty end has swagger, which can be a bit annoying, but yeah, I mean, I think you could just set up the X speed on the shift tree, right? And on the fake yeah. out turn, that's it. So yeah, big for Sydney. Yeah. So, so unlike Al Mega Ruby, where uh, Groudon uses Drought and it brings out Sun or whatever, <clears throat> uh, in this game the Shift Tree actually isn't faster than us, so it's actually pretty convenient. But it still likes to go for Fake Out on the first turn, which we usually we can use to our advantage. Yeah, Drought literally hurts Groudon more than it helps it. I feel like. Set up the spe X special attack next. No, you should just serve wait, right here. Actually, no, wait. Yeah, I just serve. I mean, on the add next. Yeah. Okay, I want to set up the X. Um, yeah, I, I haven't actually done this trap before, so I gotta make sure in my notes. Gotta make sure I'm reading them right. Yep. No worries. Right. And X speed here. Shifty likes going for fake out here. That's yeah, really bad. Wait. Okay. Oh man, okay, so what the heck? You I might just have to go here. Yeah, you should have just went. It's all right though. Well, no, I still gotta. Oh well. Well then, <laughs> I needed to set up a X special attack. I think. Um. No, with your special attack being what it is, you don't even need to set up an X attack at all. No. You can go up plus zero, yeah. And also, if you were going to do it, you really couldn't have done it there. Because it just does right. more than half. Yeah, it's just unfortunate. Leap Blade's a high crit rate move. And usually it likes going for fake out, but sometimes it can go for Leap Blade right away. I yeah. think it doesn't like going for fake out if you're not full HP. I don't know. Uh, I'm not, I don't yeah, know. there's really no thought process behind it. That's why we save. <laughs> exactly. No sucker punch this time. Yeah, no sucker punch this time, so I hopefully we'll just see fake out on this turn and everything will be alright. Good to see fake out. There we go. There we go. Yep. Now we can just go. Faster now. Nice being this. Yeah, I guess if rain goes away, then you probably would set up a. Okay, oh. Yeah, probably need to call mine now on the Sharpedo, right? Um. Well, you can Origin Pulse, also. Without rain? Yep. Okay. Wait, no, can you? No, 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 no uh, you can't. Yeah, call mine here, sure. That's the crit. Hey, nice. Oh, fuck. Okay. Yeah. Um, yeah. 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 It's very complicated for sure. Yeah, it, it can get complicated, really complicated for like no reason at all. And it's really unfortunate. And it heavily relies on on fake out. Exactly.
Still fight? better than Groudon's fight. <laughs> <laughs> He lived. Yeah. I'll just uh, heal. Yeah. Um, should I heal on Sharpedo or Cat? Yeah, Sharpedo's gonna Aqua Jet. Sharpedo. Too, so. Hopefully, I can Aqua Jet, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think we should be good here. Yeah, it should be good. Sharpedo's like... in range to die to Aqua Jet. Sharpedo's always gonna use it, so we just use his turn as a free heal turn. Well, I guess and the rain is gonna go away, so we're probably gonna have to Calm Mind and then Surf. I, mean, I guess technically we could have, we could have surfed there. Oh, we know it because uh, it didn't. It didn't, I mean, help. It didn't yeah, yeah, actually, it didn't I think I just actually surfed twice. Uh, no, I think you could just call mine surf. I think. Okay. Man, really, just coming for you. Holy moly! This is this is scary now. Yeah, you should be good. You got this. We're good. I don't have to heal after this fight anyways. Cause... No, you're chilling. With, with the way Kyogre sets up, sometimes yeah. you don't, they don't even uh, need to heal until like before Drake. So. Yeah. Yeah. Well. Kyogre's beast. Really just depends on what happens on the next couple fights though. Sometimes you have to heal before Glacia if your HP is not good uh, enough. But... I, I'm going to go for the Origin Pulse <laughs> on Death Snore. Yeah. Now, Surf should just kill it, right? No rain? Surf? Uh, well. F no, 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 no. Oh, I was looking no. at something on, else. On Death Snore. Okay. Oh, Death Snore. Yeah. Okay. I was thinking of Death Clops, I think. Yeah, again, Origin Pulse is not 100% accurate. Um, yeah. I think it only really makes sense to go for it if the, the Surf range on the second Bayonet is guaranteed, which it is. Yeah. Yeah, so I, I think it's pretty okay to go for this. Stakes aren't too high. I lost, yeah, I, lo I lost three minutes on the Sydney fight, so no longer PB pace right now. Depend on how Glacia goes, though. So. Yeah, this fight, since our special attack's so good and we have rain, uh, we literally can just surf the dust swaps here. It'll just die. It's just crazy. Yeah, it just that, dies right away. That. And that, that dust collapse is such a, it can be such a problem for us in Mega yep. Ruby. So yep. it's. It's crazy seeing like how much just easier it is in this game. Just hit. Yeah, like I did an origin pulse right here, eighty-five percent. Yeah. Easy. Saves a lot of time. Yep. Otherwise, oh, you can just set up and you know, skip all that. Take out skip one time ever. Maybe one, one year. Point. Maybe one year. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Glacia time, yeah. Let's go. True. Content Glacia central. Glacia is definitely a fight. You wanna explain that one, Bob? Or... Um, okay, yeah. I guess I can. I mean there's two major fights there's like two ways you can do it. Um most runners will opt to go for the standard way of doing it, which is like riskier on average. Which is basically just killing the first Glalie right away and setting up on wall rain. And basically just like taking like three or four turns and dodging sheer cold, <laughs> which is pretty scary. Yeah, um, it's, not, it's not even guaranteed to use sheer cold, first of all. Yeah, I can, sheer cold is not slam. a guaranteed, but yeah. it's it's scary every time. Yeah, I can body Definitely slam. Fight you want to be Paris, pretty for. scary. Yeah, Glacia is one of the more scary fights in the Nova Sapphire. Um, you could also equip the blue orb, then, then it's Never. just free. <laughs> well, that's... Free if it's like a minute time loss. Yeah.
yeah, you can do the Mega version of this fight, which is what we do in the Mega Ruby. Um, but it's just slower. But yeah, it makes the fight a lot more uh, free. It's, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna go surf and then surf, calm mind, XP, surf. For uh... uh, yes, sounds right. Yeah, we're gonna kill this Glalie right away, get it out of here. Alright, blesses. Yes. <laughs> you give it, you give it three me. turns. Oh, it's just so scary to me. I know, it is, it's very scary. I mean, what, I mean there's really nothing. I mean, what else would. Yeah, we'll see. We gotta surf here. Um, <clears throat> get a hit off. Alright, that's a good start. Right away is good, yeah, it's excellent. Gonna calm mind, because we need to go to plus one. There's oh, your. Okay. This is us. Now we need to set up an X speed. No! Oh, uh, so cringe. Damn, so close. Uh, Very close. It's not guaranteed to even use your cold, and it's also 30% to hit, so it's very, very it's sad. Isn't uh, it a little bit higher due to his, how sheer cold works? It's like 39 or something like that? Um, Because it thinks sheer cold accuracy skills based on. I don't cold. think it's that high, but it is higher, yeah. Well, that Yeah, I'm not sure, but yeah. Sounds... Oh, well. Yeah. I think it's like. <laughs> I think it's like 20. F Wait. Yeah, like 34% or something like that. Nice. Me. That's for the content. I'm just happy to. I'm just extending the marathon. Yeah, very unfortunate. I mean. It's just so silly how this fight works. Let's try this again. <laughs> I wonder if you get a really good roll and you just... Wow. Oh my goodness. God. This uh. is... Well, I'm, I'm no longer silly. upset about the Sydney fight. <laughs> uh. Uh. Where's me? Alpha Sapphire, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this fight is, is one of the fights of all time. Yeah, Without a doubt. <laughs> Hey. There's really nothing you can do because you have to set up, but I, I mean, there's something I could do. There's something you could <laughs> I do. I could orb. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Try this third time's a charm, surely, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hello. Once again. Okay. Oh my goodness, can he chill? I he's think that's problem. He's chilling too hard. <laughs> All right, come can on, not please. Chill? <laughs> Oh, oh thank God! Oh my God! Holy <laughs> <Guacamole. laughs> And that's some. Um, what's that? Five sheer colds. <laughs> <laughs> wow. We, we, oh, never, wow. we never get a single body slam. <laughs> <laughs> my goodness, that's the most alpha sapphire of all time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so very nice to be past that fight finally. <laughs> Have you know have just like enough surfs? That's why you use a weapon berry after here. Yep. 
Yeah, that is by far the worst fight <laughs> in the E4. Uh... Now we're... Drake is probably the easiest fight, I would say. Yeah, definitely. Without a doubt, and yeah. sometimes you're... Sometimes you can skip back speed, but we can't this time, unfortunately. Uh, Two four swords, I'm very scared. Me too. That'll be good. No, it should be, it actually should be fine. Because, realistically, yeah. you probably don't have to heal after this fight. Hopefully. Yeah. Yeah. Um, then you have two for Sydney. Or Steven, whatever. Right. Ideally, that's how it goes. The save button exists. Yeah. I don't... I'm not PVing anymore, so I don't... Uh, I'm not upset about what my final time is going to be. Yeah. I'll get to self-320 one day. <laughs> right. Look at that mustache on Drake. And it's a... That calm mine next speed. Yep. That's really oh, easy. It's just, yeah, set up a calm mine, set up a next speed, and go. Victory. Sometimes all you need is just a calm mind if you have good enough speed, so. We have to, yeah, I have to have a positive mixture. Dragon Pulse. It's fine. Really? Yeah, it was a hard fight. <laughs> you probably don't need to heal, maybe? Uh, I'm not gonna heal. I... You can't really afford to, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, unfortunately, we have two four stores left. So it kind of puts us in a weird situation, but it shouldn't be that big of a deal. Saving before Steven should make everything all right. Just depends what the Skarmy does on Steven. And ideally, this this um, King Dragon. Oh, Michael. that's not gonna die. Wait, why did that die? What? No. That's I call mine. Or not? There was no rain. That always does yeah, surf, even without rain. What? My mind is blown. This thing's too good. <laughs> Are you gonna be coming off Sapphire on it now? <laughs> and for a second, ignore, the, ignore the glacier. Yeah. <laughs> there's only two. There's only two two fifty fours in Alpha Sapphire. That's all I'm saying. Yep. <laughs> Feel free to check if you would like. <laughs> Hopefully we are okay here. Hopefully we do not run out of healing items. Well, no, not on Drake. Even though, yeah. Even, yeah. Uh, I don't even want to think about that. Yep. Alright, so here's Steven. We have really good special attack. Um, so we probably only need to go to uh, plus two, I would say. Not really too sure. Uh, let's see. Um, yeah. Plus yeah, Metagross two. dies the plus two serve. I mean, uh, 15 and 16. Actually, no, no, it's good. Yeah, it'll be. Uh, plus two surf, wow. Amazing. Yeah, and Credilly dies to plus two surf. It's raining. It should be. Yeah, we're gonna go for the Ice Beam right away on the Skarmory. Ideally, we freeze it. That's like the best case scenario right here. That would be pretty hype. Not even gonna lie, I've never seen it. Actually, that's a lie. I've seen it. I think Etiquette got it once. 
Oh, that's, that's really good. good. I've yeah, also that's... read it once. Um, Aerialis. Probably want to heal right now, yeah. Yeah, yeah, we do. Should be fine, though. Uh. We're only gonna, only gonna give it one more turn to Toxic. Hopefully, it just doesn't Toxic. That would be ideal. Okay, Perfect. nice. Alright. Now we should be okay. Sure, rain might wear out. If it. Uh, then, I mean, ice beam. I mean, it's not. You can ice beam, yeah. You're good. Yeah, it's ice beam. I can't watch this. It's too <laughs> sad to watch. <laughs> yeah. I'm um, gonna break the sturdy here on aggro. I'm gonna ice beam it. Hopefully, maybe freeze? Question mark. Um. Uh -huh. Let's see. I don't think you have to heal here. Don't yeah, I want to heal on uh, uh, Armadillo. Yeah, yeah. She looks... Well, actually, I don't have to... I won't... I don't think I have to heal at all, actually. Bullet, pull, bullet points range is 21-24. I mean, you might as well heal, play around crit. That's true, well. yeah. 21 is 24, that doesn't seem right. That's what my notes say. Uh, what's your defense? Um, 31, neutral. Yeah, 27 to 31, I think. Either way, you're still okay. Regardless, regardless, we need to heal here because we're in bullet punch range to die to Metagross. <laughs> but we're so. not. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Well, I mean, I mean, mine is a, a, mer, a bullet punch crit away from dying on the last yeah. one of the runs. So yeah. might as well just heal and play a little <laughs> safe and just finish. And now should be GG. And I'll I'll make sure to say time when it's yeah. time. Or I guess I could, I could just do it myself, actually. <laughs> I have, but yeah. And Good game. GG. And just smashing. Yep. <laughs> Hope everybody enjoyed Alpha Sapphire. This is a really fun game. Gen 6 has really, really slept on. It's a Pokemon Speed Gen. More people should run it. I think it's definitely gotten a lot of traction in the last, like, little bit, which is really nice. For sure. The Yimmy boards helped a lot. That's what I got me into it last year. Yep, that's yep. right. Sub estimate. This, see it. this would have been a PV two days ago. <laughs> this is, I mean, if you don't get really screwed over by Hideki, it's probably PV as well. So. Or you said near, but you know that's just how off Sapphire is, you know. Yeah, exactly. that's part of the game. You can't. And then Phoebe, you know, like. Yeah. You know, Glacier. It's just you know. I mean, that's what I meant. Glacier. Yeah. Yeah. GG's. Yeah. Sure. Uh -huh. It was a very. Fun run to commentate. I'm glad to have yeah. 13 attacks didn't end up mattering that much, right? Actually, wasn't that bad. Nope. Yeah, literally didn't. P I ducky or uh, Mudkip stats don't actually matter as much. It's just like, it just dies anyways. You know, just, as long as you save, you're, it doesn't matter. Right. And. Time is coming up here in a second. I'm. EG's. 320, 324. 46. Alright. Well, <laughs> restart the mirrors. <laughs> oh, we, know, we, gotta, we gotta do the Delta episodes now, right? Yeah. Yep. <laughs> We're round two. Uh, well, it was a lot of fun. fun. Glad, yeah. glad I was still able to do the run, even though I had internet issues. Uh... <laughs> oh, it was fun. Happy I could be a part of uh, the marathon. Appreciate it. Bye, Dad. Yeah, we're uh, glad to have you. It's quite an interesting run. Always prefer Kyogre over Groudon. Yeah. The fish. It is better. It is better. Totally not because I... Nah, it wouldn't, you you wouldn't think it is there. after how unlucky <laughs> we just yeah. got there, but it really is better. <laughs> Ray truly like Discord TV. <laughs> Oops.
That was the last run of the marathon. Yeah, it's over. Yeah. Can't believe it. It's crazy. Until next year. Right. That's some good runs this year. Really nice to have a PSR marathon again after it wasn't around last year. For sure. Yep. Definitely will be submitting something next year, so. <laughs> you, you don't have to just, you know, get randomly selected. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you guys all enjoyed the marathon. Right. Not just this run, but everything. True. You know. Yeah. Genius. I know that. Yeah. Hope you guys enjoy the outro. <laughs> <laughs> Smooth. Yeah. All right. Uh, so thank you for watching uh, this run for Alpha Sapphire by Fortunate Neil, and thank you for commentating, Truly and Headbob. Uh, yep. You were awesome. Uh, we'll be just one moment while we go ahead and transition over so we can do our outro for the end of the